The officials there at center, and I think we are about to get this one underway. Oh, I've been waiting for this all day, and we are now officially underway. Detroit's got a hold of the puck. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. Philadelphia's got a hold of it along the wall. His reflexes on display tonight. Long reach breaks up the momentum. Denied by the goaltender. Nash is taking it from his own end. They gain possession here inside the neutral zone. Good defensive stop with the poke check. Philadelphia's got a hold of it against the wall. Puck battle along the boards. Can't maintain possession. Don's got it in the defensive end. The Flyers take it along the wall. With possession along the wall. Takes the feed. The Red Wings move the puck in the defensive zone. Detroit's moving it along the wing. Puck picked up by Gunnarsson. And now he angles it across to Tommy Hawk. Shot, and he comes up with it. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. Still no score in this one. Nice job tying up his opponent. Through the middle of the ice, they enter the attacking zone. Slides it across. Dismiss that chance. Still a lot of time left in the period as we approach the midway mark. Still scoreless in this one. Good read by the winger as the two setters tie up. Puck scooped up by Gunnarsson. And he can't hang on after that hit. And puts it anywhere but the way he wanted it to go. Hit the net. No chance to score if you don't get the puck on target. Takes it into the slot. Oh, and he just puts it wide of the net. Philadelphia's gained possession along the boards. Wild Wings scooped up the puck now here inside his own zone. Looking to make something happen at center. Here's a chance. Wrists one, puts it high. Going for the top bin, he just misses it up top. The Red Wings scoop it up along the boards. Here's a shot and makes a save. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. Philadelphia's got possession here in their own end. Pass across to Wester. Philadelphia's working the transition through the middle of the ice. Wester's got the puck. The Red Wings have it against the wall. Slides it diagonally to Hall.
They say you're going to lose your mind in Detroit Rock City. Well, here we are in Detroit, Michigan. Along with Ray Ferraro, I'm James Sabalski. Ray, there was so much emphasis for years on the divisional matchups, but you really have to look at it at the conference now, like tonight. Yeah, you take you got to take a wider picture because of the way that the playoffs are structured. The games in your conference are critical. The points that you're trying to earn are the same ones they're trying to earn. And somebody's going to get them, and those will matter in a playoff spot. Well, we've been waiting for this. all day long and here we go the flyers start with possession as we are now underway scrum along the boards good heads up play in the defensive zone the red wings gain control of the puck against the wall cutting to the front of the net denies them in close this is a quality chance that the goaltender turns aside right from the slot. And he blocks the shot. Great defensive play. Black's lugging the puck. The Red Wings gain possession along the wall. They gain the offensive zone from the middle. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. Lots of time left in this period. The game is still scoreless. Detroit's got it, and they're on the attack. Moves it to the offensive zone. Detroit's got the puck in the defensive end. Tries to get it over to Black. There's the whistle from the linesman calling it offside. Detroit's won the draw, and they take possession here in the open ice. From the point, they take control of it. And the puck leaves the zone, going back to center ice. The Red Wings ready to go on the attack. And couldn't find the intended receiver on that one. The Flyers will play it in their own end. Now a quick pass to Connor. Lugs the puck into the corner of the offensive zone. Passes it over to O'Brien. Keeps hold of the puck. Throws it on goal. Denied by the goaltender. Here in the corner, he grabs the puck. Move to the middle. What a steal in his own end. Gunnarsson's got it on the offensive end. Stays with it. Let's it go. Gives them nothing in front. Good battle along the boards for the puck. 
Philadelphia's got a hold of it along the wall. The Red Wings will play the puck from behind the net. They try to maintain possession inside the defensive zone. Pucks it away in his own end. Gains the zone from the right side. Shoots it and makes the save. The Red Wings get a hold of the puck along the boards. Forces the turnover. Through center along the wing. The Red Wings carry it along the wall. Can't finish. Oh, Ray, and blown opportunity. It really is. I mean, the play is sitting right there. There's a scoring chance to be had. They just don't execute it. Philadelphia's got the puck along the boards and tries to make a diagonal pass to Travis. From the top of the offensive zone here, battling for it along the boards. Scooped up along the wall by Erickson. And that one's broken up by a great defensive play. Detroit's got the puck along the wall. Looking for space inside the D zone. Strong defensive effort. Detroit's got a hold of it against the wall. Hangs onto the puck. And that's picked off. Cozen's got it in the defensive zone. Across the line from center. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. Here's a short pass to Hall. And he says no! Philadelphia's gained possession along the boards. Through center. Pokes it away here in the neutral zone. To the front! Puck grabbed by Lee. Back to the blue line. Quick pass to King. Chance in front. Big save by the goaltender watching that one. He's sharp on that one. Nowhere to go for the puck. Takes the feed. Makes the save. What a reaction with the blocker. Loose puck battle along the boards. Offside the call, and we'll have a face-off just outside the blue line. Up, he flares up the arm with the blocker. Makes a pretty good save here. In the final moments of this period, we've still got zeros on the board. The Flyers win the draw here in the neutral zone. Streaking through center, they go on the attack. And he puts that one aside with ease. Gutierrez has it along the boards. Paco's got the puck now here inside his own defensive zone. Picked up along the boards by Harris and pokes the puck loose inside the offensive end. The Flyers play it along the boards. Moves it to Paco. Detroit's looking to break out of their own end. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. Quick feed to Travis. That's not gonna fool him. makes an excellent save on this scoring chance. The centermen glide into position. And nearing the final 60 the seconds of this opening stanza. Pokes the puck away. Battle along the boards. Grabs the puck in the corner. Moves it around along the half wall. The Flyers scoop it up along the boards. Pumps the puck away. That concludes the first period. Really, both teams still filling each other out here as we are still scoreless. Hey, fans, don't forget to enter tonight for our team signed poster, which will give away before the end of tonight's game. Both teams heading down the tunnels. We'll take a quick breath ourselves and be back for the second period. Both teams had a chance to recharge, and the officials set to drop the puck here on period number two. Second period underway, we're still in search of our first goal in this one. 
Ray, we've already got 20 minutes under our belt here. What are your thoughts of this one so far? Man, that was slow, James. That first period, nobody generated any offense. Just a few shots to test the goaltenders. Nice defensive robbery with the stick. Here's an offensive chance. Steps into all of that. Moves it quickly over to David. And it's a quick pass to Black. Handles the puck. Good defensive effort to poke it away. Lee stick handling in his own zone. Smart defensive play here in the open ice. From the left side into the middle of the neutral zone. Here's a short pass to Nash. Scores! And Hockey Town's loving that! Oh, he hangs his head here, James. We look at it on the replay. He thought he stopped it, but he didn't get all of it, and it goes into the net. Detroit's had plenty of chances, but they also finally have the game's first goal. I'd rather have less chances and score earlier than this. This is when frustration starts to creep in. While the centers are jammed up, nice job by the winger to steal the puck. The Red Wings have it against the wall. They fight for it along the boards. Pokes it away to stay on the attack. The Flyers gain possession of the puck here in the offensive end. Into the corner. Oh, smart heads up play to poke that one away. Grabbed along the boards by O'Brien. Detroit's got it in their own zone. Trying to get back on the attack now. Taken by Gunnarsson. The Red Wings gain control of the puck against the wall. Gaining momentum along the wing. Handles the pass from the right wing. Centering pass, and that one's blocked. Right in front. The lane was plugged up and that shot's blocked. Oh, and he missed the opportunity there. Sends the pass over. Denied that one. Oh, he reads the play really well to get out and aggressive to make that save. Wrist shot from the slot. Spectacular stunt by the goaltender. How did he hang on to that? Certain saves are more difficult than others. This one right from the slot is turned aside. Quick pass to Butcher. Picked up along the wall by Hall. And he regains control of the puck. And now he tries to get it across to Stinger. Couldn't connect on that pass. Big play inside the defensive zone. The Red Wings gain possession along the wall. Working the puck deep inside their own end. Here they come up along the wing. Philadelphia's got it along the wall. Detroit's got a hold of it along the wall. Black's got the puck in his own zone. Looking to set up offensively. Black's been tripped up, and we got a penalty coming up here. And that's off the iron! Time for the official to pass down his sentence. He's going off for tripping, Ray. Reaching in for the puck, and he gets his stick caught in their feet. The Red Wings get their man advantage unit out there for the first time tonight. I always felt on the power play, the first one was really important for any team. If you stumble around on the first power play, guys start to press as you get more and more of them through the game. The Red Wings have it behind the net. Feeds it up ahead. Love the way he moved that puck up quickly. Moves it to Nash. And the puck skips off the goal. Here's a chance behind the net. And that's broken up with a stick in front. Detroit's got possession here in the offensive zone. Trying to clear the puck from his own end. And they do just that. Oh, I thought they did a pretty good job there, James. That's a time you can get yourself running around in the zone. They didn't get there. On the attack along the boards. Here's a chance in front. Big save. From behind the net. Misses. Get it on the cage. Make the goalie do something with it. Trying to get it out of their own end. Cross the blue line, and they'll get that much-needed change, Ray. Yeah, they've got to get guys off the ice. They look tired. Now you can get a fresh group on the ice. Great positioning by the defender. Gets the puck in deep. Detroit's looking to break out. And now it's over to Hall. 
gains the zone. Power play is over. Both teams back to even strength. Well, a good power play is about 20%, James. That one falls in the other 80%. They don't get it done. The power play expires. And a poke check knocks the puck away. Philadelphia's got a hold of it against the wall. Manages to hang on. Quick feed to Don. Here they are on the attack. Detroit's got it in their own zone. Takes the pass as he banks it off the wall. The Flyers get a hold of the puck along the boards. Great defensive effort with the stick. Moves it quickly over to Travis. Denies him in front. Oh, he had to get up tight to the puck. In close, he takes away any room. Philadelphia's gained possession along the boards. With some open space at center. Takes the pass from the left wing. Cuts into the paint. And he denied that opportunity. But he came out and challenged him. Good save. These are positional saves. This is a good scoring chance, and he makes the stop with his stick. Here in the later stages of this period, Detroit's ahead, 1-0. Philadelphia's won the draw. Moved into the middle. Takes the feet at the back end. Centering pass in front. And a good use of the body to knock the puck loose. Detroit's up for good reason. They have been the more complete team offensively, which is why they lead late in the second. Harper's won the draw deep in the defensive zone. From center, they get into the attacking area. Sends it across. Stopped by the goaltender. Chrisman's play has been outstanding tonight. From the time the puck hit the ice, he's been locked in. Great save percentage, and he's a reason they're close in this game. Play set to resume with the face-off ready to go. The Flyers win the draw. Taken along the wall by Domi. Grabs the puck in the defensive zone. And the middle frame almost done. No one home on that play. Detroit's got the puck along the boards. Exploring options here inside the defensive zone. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. They've got the defense outnumbered. Takes a shot, stopped by the goaltender. Chrisman's helping out everybody here. The defense doesn't have to worry about the front of the net anymore. The puck's in the corner. And that'll do it for period number two. The Red Wings take a lead, albeit a small one. They're up 1-0 after 40. If you want to show us your accuracy, register now for our Shoot to Win contest where one lucky fan... Don't go anywhere. Third period is just around the corner. Exciting prize. Third period action. Are you ready? I'm ready. Ray's ready. The players are ready. Let's go. Here we go. Put up or shut up for both teams here in this third period. We are underway. Ray, with two periods in the books, what are your thoughts on the game to this point? Philadelphia's first two periods have been marred by turnovers. Every time it looks like they're going to get something going, they burp up another one. They don't have the puck much, and they're behind in the game. Loses possession after he takes a little hit. Puck battle along the boards. Nice poke check inside the attacking zone. Philadelphia's got the puck along the wall. Sends a pass over. And now he moves it to Harris. Puts it on net. Comes up with the stop. The Red Wings scoop it up along the boards. Quick pass across to Nash. Offside is the call, and we'll have a face-off just outside the offensive zone. Those are the saves that are gifts from the goaltender. That looked like an automatic goal. He's able to make the stop. Detroit's done a wonderful job putting a lot of pucks on net, and they lead it early in this third period. The Flyers take possession off the faceoff. That pass goes a little sideways. Not able to connect. Here's a short pass to Harris. Hard hit on the play. Wow, did he ever finish him hard. And when he dropped...
also dropped his stick. Now he's got to collect himself. Looks like a yard sale out there. The Flyers have it against the wall. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. The Flyers will play it from the defensive zone. Scoops up the puck here. And now he angles it across to Gunnarsson. Across the line. Wallstone's taking the puck now here inside his own territory. Great balance as he scoops it back up. Scooped up along the wall by Harper. Philadelphia's regained possession of the puck. They try to maintain possession inside the defensive zone. Nice stick work to knock the puck loose. Takes it and looks ahead. Good hit to bump him off the puck. Quick pass to Harper. The Red Wings have it now. Here they come on the attack. The Flyers gain control of the puck against the wall. Looking for space inside the D zone. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. Nice poke check. The Red Wings gain possession along the wall. Enters the offensive zone from the left. Here's a chance. Makes the save. Crispin's gonna hang on for a whistle here in the third. Well, there's not much time left here as you get into the final 20 minutes. The game's close. A mistake now would be critical. He ran right through him on that hit. Lined him up, timed it perfectly. Still lots of time left in the period. We've got a 1-0 hockey game thus far. Great read by the winger to take possession with the two centermen tied up. Detroit's got a hold of it along the wall. Pins them against the boards as they battle for the loose puck. Grabbed along the boards by Gunnarsson. Carrying the puck deep inside his own end. Puts it in deep. Detroit's got a hold of it against the wall. Maintains possession. Puts him into the wall. James, there's the difference between getting by or getting crunched. He's a half a second from a great move. Instead, he got flattened. Detroit's got it against the boards. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. Philadelphia's got it in their own zone. And there's the save. Crispin's got the puck, and he'll hang on for the whistle. Well, in a close game, you've got to be in control of things, and he's had an excellent night so far. Yeah, I wanted another look at this one. I'm sure you guys were all impressed as I was. What a save by the goalie. Detroit's attempt to put more pucks on net has paid off as they lead it in the third. And with the two centers tangled up, the winger skates away with it. Puts it up front. Backhand with intention. Stopped by the goaltender. A spirited battle along the boards for the puck. The Flyers will play it in their own end. Philadelphia's moving the puck through center ice. Reads it perfectly, breaking up the play. The Red Wings continue to be in the right place at the right time. And he scores! It's good to be greedy. You get one, you chase that next one. Really put your foot down on the opponent. So nice, they snipe twice. I don't think the goaltender gets a look at this at all, James. He just drops into the butterfly. He's hoping the thing hits him through that traffic. The Red Wings are up by a pair now here late in this third period. What's the strategy now, Ray? I would say the most important thing is do not turn the puck over in the middle of the ice. When you get to the red line, make sure it's going forward. Philadelphia's gained possession along the boards. The Red Wings take possession in the defensive end. Erickson's got it in the offensive zone. Chance right in front. He gets a piece of it with a stick. High quality chance, high quality save. This shot comes from a real dangerous area on the ice, but the goalie's in position and he makes a nice stick save. Detroit's not far from the finish line here as they lead it late in this third. Offense is on face off and he wins the draw. Look out, scores! His second of the well, things go well for you if you score multiple times in a game. This has been a terrific night for him.
I don't know how many times you talk about setting up a face-off play. It never works, except this time it did. Face-off win and a shot into the net. The Red Wings are on absolute cruise control here in the third. Well, they've built such a large margin, you can use your whole bench and coast it in. Detroit's got a hold of the puck off the draw. Slides it on over to Black. Jabs the puck away. And now it's grabbed by Fowler. And he connects with the long bomb. Good vision to see the long pass. Nothing doing on that. The Red Wings get a hold of the puck along the boards. There's the whistle. Offside is the call, stopping the play. The Red Wings have pummeled their opponents tonight. They have been the busier team offensively and have converted numerous times here in this third period. And play resumes as the puck is dropped. Travis plays it into the offensive zone. Feeds the puck to Black. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Nash is able to take that quick pass. He's already got a couple of goals. He's looking for a third. Keeps hold of the puck. The Flyers scoop it up along the boards. From the defensive zone, they move the puck around. Takes the feed at center and moves up ahead. Under a minute to go here in regulation time. Battling for it along the boards. Moves it to Harper. The Red Wings take it across the line. Detroit's playing it from the side. Tremendous use of the body on the play. Philadelphia's got the puck along the boards. Stays with it. Gets a stick on it to make the save. Centering pass. And the puck departs the zone. Don's taking it from his own end and tries to make a diagonal pass to Tommy Hawk. Sends it over to Wild Wing. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Getting a little too physical to maintain possession. Sends it down low. Couldn't connect, although not exactly an ideal pass to begin with. And that's all she wrote on that one. A shutout tonight, and more importantly, the two points. That'll be a nice little bonus ticket for him as you chalk up enough shutouts to get a little cash in your pocket at the end of the year and a big two points. And a nice tip of the cap from the home team after a job well done. Uh, you give the fans something to cheer about, they'll stay and cheer you on. A nice win at home. Well, this one's in the books. A fun one tonight for Ray Ferraro. My name is James Sabalski. Thanks for joining us, everyone. Good night.
Hi, everybody. Along with Ray Ferraro, I'm James Sabalski. Welcome to Las Vegas. Fritz, one of those guys that our cameras will be keeping close tabs on here tonight. His name is up on the board in the opposition's dressing room. He's a player they will key on trying to stop. Opening face-off just... away the Panthers take possession here on the opening draw and we are underway hangs on to the puck here's a shot and that one's turned away quick feed to flurry Vegas has it in the defensive end right up the gut into the attacking zone they've got numbers moves inside Turn that chance aside. Now, oh, by being in the right position, James, he gets so tight to the shooter, there's nowhere for the puck to go. Moves it quickly over to Bear. Nice pass. Great hand eye by the goaltender, poking it away. And pokes the puck loose inside the offensive end. Denies him! Quick reflexes. You make one, you make two stops before the puck is cleared away. Inside the offensive zone. Loses his balance on the play. Vegas gets the puck near the boards. Here's a short pass to XD. Nice zone entry from the right side. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. Receives the pass. Slides the puck over. Excellent stick work on the play. Puck scooped up by Flurry. From the neutral zone, moving forward here along the boards. Franco's got it now deep inside his own end. Into the middle of the neutral zone. Puck picked up by Felix. Made that stop. Still lots of time left here in this frame. We're still scoreless. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Taken by Lewis. Good defensive stop with the poke check. Through the middle of the ice, they enter the attacking zone. Centering pass. Just can't complete that pass. Oh, he's got the right play in mind. He just doesn't execute the final pass. Devils on the attack in the offensive zone. Vegas has possession of it now. Here's a chance right in the slot, and that's blocked. Now he slides it up to Biggs. Huge steal in his own end. From the left side, they enter the offensive zone. From point blank range, nothing. Vegas tries to break out from their own end. From along the walls, they're gaining momentum. And he regains control of the puck. And he uses his reach to disrupt the play. Manages to hang on. Florida's got the puck along the wall. Dumps it into the O-zone. Vegas gains a hold of it. Urquhart works the puck in his own zone. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. A chance on goal. Big time stop there. Vegas takes possession along the wall. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. Check on. Florida's got a hold of the puck. Maintains possession. Here's a chance to set up now. Just wide. You can go games without a chance from here. Picked up along the boards by Cronwall. Moves it on over to Trucker. Here's an odd man rush. Posts it away to stay on the attack. Florida's looking to break out of their own end. Gaining momentum along the wing. Lugs the puck into the corner of the offensive zone. Stays with it. Here he is in close. Makes the save as he got a blocker on it. I like the goalie's positioning here. He was aggressive enough to make a save on a dangerous chance. Takes the pass. 
and uses the length of his stick to knock that puck away. They fight for it along the boards. The Panthers have it against the wall. Here's a chance to make something happen inside the neutral zone. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. The Panthers gain possession along the wall, trying to get back on the attack now. Florida's got the puck in the defensive end. Here's a chance. Quick pass to Felix. Glove save, and he handles it with ease. As a great older colleague of mine says, this is waffle boarded away. Just here in the late stages of this frame, still looking for our first goal. Sneaks away with the puck after he was tangled up on the draw. Vegas looks to break out in their own end. Puck grabbed by Felix. The Panthers take it along the wing. Moves the puck along the half wall. Pinned up along the boards. The Panthers gain control of the puck against the wall. From the blue line, they take control of it. Made the stop on the play. Michaels had to jump right into this game. No easing in. He's been busy, but he's been perfect in the early going. Puck possession so critical. Another face-off coming up here. And they take possession. Nice job tangling him up on the draw. Vegas moves it ahead. Moves the puck with the stop. Another stop by the goaltender. There's the horn bringing period number one to an end. Still no score in this one. Do you know someone in your community who goes the extra mile to help out? Nominations for our team player awards are available in the concourse in the lower And as both level. teams head to their respective rooms, two more periods still to come. We're looking forward to it here on EA Sports. Well, the first 20 is in the books. Let's see what this second period offers. No goals yet through the first 20 minutes. Let's see if this changes here in period number two as we get underway. One period already in the books. Ray, how have you seen this thing? The Panthers coaches would have told their players, play the same way. We had the puck a lot. I know the game's scoreless, but we're doing everything right. Keeps possession on the play. And they fail to go tape to tape. And a penalty coming up as the official blows the play dead. He's going off for tripping. And doesn't everybody feel like they're innocent on a trip? You feel like you're innocent on most every penalty. But this one always feels like, ah, did you really have to call it? First chance of the night here on the man advantage. What a great opportunity to get the first strike on the board. Scoreless game, you go on the power play, you want to attack this. You can change the way the game looks in the next two minutes. Florida's got a hold of it along the wall. Vegas has it in the offensive end. Florida's got it behind the net. Puck moved back to the neutral zone. Vegas has it near the wall. And as he stumbles, he coughs up the puck. Florida's penalty killers get a hold of it. The Panthers get a hold of the puck along the boards. Deflected away. Nice defensive use of the stick there. Takes the feed. Move to the middle. Puts it on goal. And that goes wide. Florida's got the puck shorthanded. Oh, he'd like to have that pass back. We'll get a face off. And some lucky fan. Gets a memory of a lifetime. Lots of time left in this period. The game is still scoreless. The Panthers win it. Here inside the defensive zone, they get the puck. Dumps it in. Vegas gains a hold of the puck against the boards. 
Nice zone entry from the left. The Panthers will kill off a few extra seconds now. Tyler's got it across the line. He's got a step, and he's able to handle that one. The Golden Knights fire blanks on the power play. We're back to even strength here. And he totally whiffs on that one. Hey, I think I killed two penalties in my life. Looked to me like the penalty killers did a good job there. They didn't really give up anything. Vegas has it behind the net. Florida's got control of it now here in the offensive end. Comes up with a stop. Oh, you can see the shooter. He looked straight up to the sky. He thought that was past the goalie. But the tender made enough of a save to keep the puck out of the net. Still a lot of time left in the period as we approach the midway mark. Still no score in this one. Turns it away. Sometimes you're in close. There's no room to put it anywhere. The goalie smothered it all. Along the boards, they battle for the puck back and forth. Florida's got a hold of it against the wall. Oh, what a save with a glove. Florida's ready to go on the attack. Centering pass. Stopped by the goaltender. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. Florida's won the draw and they'll go to work. And they can't finish that one. Oh, he's going to be kicking himself for that. The play was there. He just doesn't execute that last pass for the scoring opportunity. Turn that one aside. Well, what a quick reflex stop that is. Great scoring chance. Lewis is quick on the draw. Denies him. He got all of it. The Golden Knights scoop it up along the boards. Vegas moves ahead with the puck. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. And he slides it quickly to Akers. Drives to the paint. Stopped by the goaltender. He'll check his stick after this. He makes the save on a really good scoring chance. Nice start winning the draw here inside the offensive zone. That goes wide. Battle along the boards. Nice poke check inside the attacking zone. Hendry's gaining momentum. Skates to the crease. We've got a penalty coming up on the play. Biggs is caught for the trip, and he's going on a trip to the penalty box. Once he puts up his little token argument here, he's going to circle around a bit and try and regroup here as he goes to the penalty box. Were you box. a haggler? Always. You never think it's the right call. As they step into the face-off circle, let's see if they can take advantage on this power play. Well, the first power play shows up. Now you've got to take advantage of it. You've got one more man. Move the puck. Get some chances. See if you can break the scoreless tie. Past the halfway mark of this period, we've still got zeros on the board. Florida's got it, and they're on the attack. Answered the call on that play. Michael's done it again. Another terrific save. And he's kept this game close. Works it across to Outlaw. Tries to get the puck to Zimmer. Takes it across the blue line. Vegas gains possession shorthanded. Here's a chance to clear the defensive zone. And clearing attempt is a big success on that play. Florida's got the puck along the wall. Here they come up along the wing. Takes a wrist shot, stones him in front. Vegas with possession in their own zone. And that pass goes awry. Puck is cleared out of the defensive zone. Trying to get something going here with this man advantage as they start from their own end. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. Moves it to Bear. Here he is on the backhand. Gives them nothing in front. 
Yeah, he got out tight to him, James. There's nowhere for that puck to go. Move to the middle. Stops him cold. Michael's a little bit fortunate there. He makes a terrific stop, but he just gets a piece of it to keep it out of the net. The setters will glide into the dot. Back underway, and they take possession here inside the offensive zone. Biggs jumps out of the box, and we are back to even strength. Well, I can't. Oh, look at that. Here we go. We got a penalty coming up right here. Play is blown dead. We've got a penalty on the way. Outlaw's mugging of the player pretty cut and dry on this one, holding the call. As soon as you fall behind, which I guess is probably the reason for most penalties, you're in desperation mode. He grabs onto him and he'll go to the box for a couple. As we're about to drop the puck, the power play unit back out onto the ice for another opportunity. Slides in off the wing after the centerman tied him up. They've been skunked on the power play so far tonight. So you have a little chat on the bench. Guys, notice some things that the penalty killers do, and you try to adjust one step ahead of them. Good heads-up play in the defensive zone. Big save. I like the way he tracks the puck here. He's got to find it, and then he gets his body right in front of it. That's a good save. Vegas has possession of it now. Quick feed to Soderberg. Takes a shot, denies him with a save. Slides the puck across to Cronwall. The Golden Knights will play it from the defensive zone. Looks to get the puck over to Devil. And now he tries to get it across to Cheek. Huge play in his own end to come up with the puck. They get it out of the defensive end. Loose puck battle along the boards. it away to keep the pressure on from their own end time winding down here on this power play they got to get something going here yeah you got to get into the zone first james get it set up start moving the puck around but they've got to get into the zone quickly both teams back to even strength as the power play comes up empty-handed and we are still tied the only positive for the power play there is they didn't have to skate up and down the ice they didn't generate anything they had it in the zone but really nothing very good about it right on top of this scoring chance. Nowhere for the puck to go. Here in the late goings of the period, still scoreless in this one. And as the puck is dropped, they win the draw here inside the defensive zone. Regains possession at center. Pokes it away in his own end. And too much traffic in front blocks that one. The Golden Knights are on the attack. Strong defensive effort. Mills takes it inside his own end. Good reach to the stick to knock the puck away. Vegas takes possession along the wall. Florida's trying to make something happen in the offensive zone. Good defensive effort to poke it away. Streaking through center, they go on the attack. Picked up along the wall by Flurry. Gets in front of it. Bears on the receiving end of this huge hit. Sometimes you've got nowhere to go. Play set to resume with the face-off ready to go. The frozen biscuits dropped, and we are back underway here. And now he moves it quickly to Linden. Here he is from the slot, and that goes wide. No, he's got to get that on target. That's a scoring chance, and he doesn't even make a, the goaltender make a save. The Panthers move the puck in the defensive zone. Manages to hang on. With possession along the wall. Here's a chance with the stop. Puck battle along the boards. And as the second period comes to an end, what can you say? This has been all about the goalies tonight. Still scoreless. Are you ready for your walk down memory lane? Then join us for our fantasy game. Play hockey with your childhood heroes. Don't it's go anywhere. Third memory. period and is coming up, and it's coming up next. Details.
And we are just moments away from the start of the third period. Still scoreless as we are now underway in the third. Florida's got the puck against the half wall. Scrum along the boards. And pokes the puck loose inside the offensive end. The Golden Knights gain possession along the wall. Dishes it to Flurry. And skilled use of the stick to poke the puck away. Nice speed from the left side up the middle. Florida's got a hold of it along the wall. Puts it to the front of the net. Stopped by the goaltender. No room for the shooter. The goaltender snuffed it out. Zimmer's moving the puck through his own zone. The Golden Knights have it against the wall. Vegas takes possession of the puck. And he breaks up the opportunity in front with a poke check. Vegas has it in the offensive end. The Panthers gain control of the puck against the wall. Scrum ensues along the boards. Pokes it away to stay on the attack. The Golden Knights get a hold of the puck along the boards. And now it's grabbed by Flurry. Franco's got the puck in his own zone. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. Moves it quickly over to Flurry. Vegas exploring options from the blue line. And he can't get it off. And that's picked off. Under siege and finally grabs that one and covers up for a whistle. Now we'll get another look at this. That's a good shot, but the goalies get to block her up to make the save. Getting closer to the halfway point of this frame, we're still scoreless. Swoops in off the wing to grab the puck after the centerman tied him up. Battling for it along the boards. Felix is moving it ahead. Here they are on the attack. The official signaling for a penalty as play is called. May not like the call, but the officials still see it as hooking. It doesn't take very long to get on the wrong side of the play. You're a step behind. You've got to slow that guy down. You can't catch him. Maybe you can get away with a hook. Not here. Just tried to play catch up and got burned. The Panthers send their man advantage unit out once more. The best power plays are the ones that are successful after they've failed. They haven't been very good tonight, but you have to wash that away. Not let it affect the current power play. And the puck leaves the zone. Eller's got control of it now behind the cage. Solid hit on the play, and that knocks the puck off his stick. Here's a short pass to Felix. He scores on the power play! Taking advantage of the extra man, move the puck well and get on the board. Now the only way he's stopping this one is if it hits him. As soon as the shooter went to shoot it, the goaltender dropped into the butterfly. He's looking around that traffic, hoping he can find it. Florida's been pushing all night long offensively. They finally get the big goal to put them up here in the third. They've had the puck the whole time, it seems like. Chance after chance. There was a danger here. They were going to get frustrated, but now they have the lead. The Panthers carry it along the wall. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. Takes the feed. From center, they get into the attacking area. Here he is, shot right in front. Played big in the moment there. Inching closer to the midway mark of this period, the Panthers have taken a 1-0 lead. And with the two centers tangled up, the winger skates away with it. Quick pass to low. Florida's got it along the wall. Keeps hold of the puck. Here's a chance. He scores! They make it another! They don't slow down. You get one, you get two. The goalie gets overpowered here. He gets a little piece of the shot. It goes past him anyway.
The Panthers have been the aggressor offensively tonight as they continue to lead in the third. This neutral zone faceoff set to go, and we are back underway. The Panthers look to start the transition game, and they'll dump it in. They fight for it along the boards. Vegas has it near the wall, trying to get back on the attack now. The Panthers get a hold of it. From the left side, takes it at center. Moves it to Lee. Here he is, wristed on that. Blocker save, and he's showing up big time tonight. He's sharp on this one, out on top of the crease, aggressively to make the save. Vegas has the puck. Quick pass to Cheek. Can't connect. Oh, smart heads up play to put that one away. Hangs on to the puck. Florida's gained possession along the boards. The Panthers have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. And he regains control of the puck. The Golden Knights scoop it up along the boards. Grabs the puck and looks to make something happen. Scooped up along the wall by Lee. A spirited battle along the boards for the puck. Cheeks got it in the defensive zone. Handles the pass at center. Long reach breaks up the momentum. Taken along the wall by Eller. The Panthers gain possession in their own end. Maintains possession. Handles the puck. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Puck scooped up by Eller. And there's the whistle as he elects to slow things down a little. A pretty good decision here with the play starting to break down in front of him. I loved making that save in road hockey, the old blocker stop. Here in the late goings of the period, Florida's got some breathing room as they lead it 2-0. The Panthers win the draw. Florida's looking to break out. They go on the attack from the left side. Vegas gets the puck near the boards. Here he is in front! And that shot goes nowhere as the lane was filled. Oh, and he slowed him up, and the official's right there all over it. Scores! Well, they were going to get a power play. You don't get one now. That goal will nullify the penalty. They just outman the defensive team here. Once they aggressively pull the goaltender, they swarm the puck, and they're able to capitalize. Florida's only continued to extend the lead here in the third. They haven't missed many chances. They've scored at will, and now we're coasting home. Locks them up on the draw as they take possession. Scoops up the puck now. Pinned up along the boards. Nice poke check inside the attacking zone. Here's a shot! Makes the save on the slapper! Great defensive effort with the stick. Florida's got control of it now here in the offensive end. Urquhart carries the puck in his own zone. Nice zone entry on the left side. Stays with it. Snaps one on net. And the traffic neutralizes that threat. Under a minute to go in the third. All alone! Oh, he didn't have enough gas to get the shot off. Really good work by the defender to close the gap. The Golden Knights will play it in their own end. Tosses it on to Britt. Tosses it to Duncan. Quick feed to Monopoly. And that one stopped. Big stop by the keeper. In tight, he had to make an excellent save. Lowe's got it into offensive territory. Puck picked up by Linden. From the left side, they gain the zone. Vegas has it against the half wall. And that's broken up. And the goalie covers up for the whistle. Stone's able to make the save, as we see here. This is a good scoring chance, but he's in good position. The Panthers are in the home stretch of this one, leading big time in the third. Takes possession off the draw. The Golden Knights ready to go on the attack. Stopped by the goaltender. Moves the puck over to Outlaw. Unable to reach that one. And a nice poke check inside the neutral zone. Final horn 
just sounded, and that's all she wrote tonight. It felt early that he was locked in on this one, and look at the final score. He was. Yeah, you make those first couple of saves in the way that he did, and it seems to just carry forward. What a terrific night for him. And that'll do it for Ray Ferraro. I'm James Sabalski. Thank you.
Everybody, along with Ray Ferraro, I'm James Savalski. Welcome to B-Town here in historic Boston, Massachusetts. A chance for both sides to see some of the different stars in the different conferences here, Ray. Absolutely, James. It becomes a fun night because everything's a little different, and we all know that if you see something you don't normally see, it kind of perks your attention. For the players, it's kind of interesting, too. New guys to play against. Opening face-off is just seconds away. The Flames take possession here on the opening draw, and we are underway. Off the left wing and into center. Denied by the goaltender. We're still in the early stages of this period. Still looking for our first goal. Kamenev's won it off the faceoff. Your boy Ovens got it in the defensive end. The Bruins looking against the half wall. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. Hammers one from the point. Way too high. He powders this shot from the point, except it's over four feet high. It goes racing over the top of the net. Might make the goaltender a little nervous next time he unloads. Working to shake the pressure from the defensive zone. And they're off to the races for the loose puck. Icing's the call. You know the coaching staff's not going to love that one. Well, I can think of about three plays he could have made other than that one, but hey, that's the way it goes. Now you need your centerman to win a draw. Nice job tying up his opponent. The Bruins have it now. Sends the pass over. Boston's got it into the offensive zone. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. And he comes up with it. Grabbed along the board by Taylor. Taken by Kamenev. Puck grab by Esquivel. Tries to get it to Travis. The Flames take it along the wall. Big play inside the defensive zone. Boston's got control of it now from their own end. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. Bell's lugging the puck. Scrum along the boards. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. Couldn't complete the play. Boston's got it in their own zone. Calgary's got a hold of it against the wall. Nice feed at center, moves up ahead now. And he uses his reach to disrupt the play. Cutting to the front of the net. The Bruins gain possession along the wall. Gaining momentum along the wing. Calgary's going to play it along the blue line. Great poke check on the reach. Tyler's got the puck now here inside his own defensive zone. Nice poke check. Calgary's got the puck along the boards. Moves it quickly over to Kachuk. Scoops up the puck here. The Bruins going to work on offense. Sends a pass over. Denies him in front. Yeah, he's a sharp save, James. Right in the middle of the ice, he makes the stop and pushes it away. The Flames played along the boards. Can't hang on after that hit. Boston's got the puck along the wall. They've got the defense outnumbered. Here's the pass. 
No, the puck doesn't get there. It's so crowded in front of the goaltender. Wrist shot from the slot. Stopped by the goaltender. Manages to hang on. And he slides it quickly to Applewhite. Aaron pass, and the play's broken up. Calgary's ready to go on the attack. That's wide of the net. Here's a short pass to Kachuk and uses the length of his stick to knock that puck away. They've got numbers to his teammate. Oh, bold move by the goaltender as he pokes it away. Denies him. Nice move by the goalie to get out close to the shooter. Again, the denial by the goaltender. Quick pass to Kachuk. Here's an odd man rush. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. And that puck leaves the zone. Smart defensive play there. Nice pass. Skates across the blue line. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. Scrum ensues along the boards. And a poke check knocks the puck away. And the play continues. Delayed penalty coming up here. Now a quick pass to Gustafson. Through the middle of the ice, they enter the attacking zone. Right in the slot, snaps it onto the net, they score! This seemed like an inevitability here. Once a delayed penalty arm goes up, it seems like the defending team just fell back on their heels. They didn't do anything really to slow down the opposition. This is a really good shot, but the goaltender waves at it, doesn't get the glove on it, and it goes in. Boston's taken the lead here in the late goings of this first period. Pretty even first period. Now they've got the jump. You want to get into the intermission ahead. Good read by the winger as the two setters tie up. Sends it in on the attack. And by number 25. Picked up along the boards by Stahl. And pokes the puck loose inside the offensive end. Boston's got a hold of it along the wall. Misses the net. You're going to go back and kick yourself for that one because he wants that on the net. He doesn't miss it by much. Sent into the offensive zone. Regan's got it now deep inside his own end. Keeps hold of the puck. Pokes it away to stay on the attack. Fires it into the offensive zone. The Bruins get a hold of the puck along the boards. And it's a quick pass to Kamenev. Can't connect. Couldn't complete the play. Hangs onto the puck. Maintains possession. And now it's grabbed by Kamenev. Jabs the puck away. Shot! Turns it away! Croft does a really nice job here to get himself in front of the puck, keep his eyes locked on it, and make the stop. The Bruins lead it here late in this first period. And there it is. 20 minutes is in the books of this one. The Bruins get off to a good start. They lead 1-0. Hey, hockey fans. Follow the team all season long on the radio for every minute of play-by-play -play action. Both still lots of hockey play. still to come, so to get ready here on EA Sports. Or on your smartphone. Official has made his way back to center ice, and we are ready to go for period number two. Well, after an intriguing opening period, here we go. It's period number two. Puck is dropped, and we are underway. One period already in the books. Ray, how have you seen this thing? Cross is going to be exhausted if the game goes like this. In that first period, he was crazy busy. Done an outstanding job. Calgary's got a hold of the puck. Now over to Esquivel. Takes a shot, makes a save as that goes off the glove. Gish has scooped up the puck now here inside his own zone. Boston's looking to break out. 
Ahead of steam now towards the front. Here's a chance, fires the wrist shot. Answered the call there. And now it's over to Black. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Taylor. And makes a save. Calgary's moving it along the wing. Shot and makes a save. Right to the middle. The Flames play it along the wing. No quarter given here as they battle for the loose puck along the boards. The Bruins move to the offensive zone. Excellent stick work on the play. At center ice now, he grabs the puck. Strong defensive effort. Referee's got his hand up, signaling a delayed penalty. And he regains control of the puck. And play comes to an end as someone is heading to the sin bin. Referee Gilles Levesque calling holding here on this one. Yeah, he didn't hesitate either, James. No. It's like as soon as the player got close, it's like you could tell there was something going to happen. It's a holding call. The Bruins will have a chance to get on the power play for the first time this evening. This is the league's best power play. Now they get their first opportunity to try and increase their lead. They'll want to clear the zone here while they're trying to kill off this penalty. And they get some breathing room as the puck leaves the defensive end. From their own end, trying to kickstart this power play. Moves it to Fred Hyde. Good defensive stop with the poke check. Green's trying to screen the goalie, but at the same time, stay right out of that blue paint. Black's working it around in the corner. Quick feed to Fred Heim. Here he is with the backhander. Big stop by the goaltender right in front. I like how he was able to follow the puck. Good save in close. Denies him with the save. The Flames will try to shave a few seconds off this penalty now. And they manage to clear it. Grabs the puck and moves on out here with this man advantage. Stays with it. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. And the shot dies in the traffic jam. Off a stick. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. Fredheim's on the attack in the offensive zone. Calgary's going to be able to kill a few seconds off now with the puck. And a successful clearing attempt. Boston's got it behind the net. The Flames kill off the penalty. A lot of head shaking on the bench when you go back after a power play like that. Well executed, lots of pressure, just couldn't finish. Puck scooped up by Fleener. With some open space here in the neutral zone. Good reach to the stick to knock the puck away. Slides it across to Blades. Boston's got it across the line. Puck picked up by Taylor. Oh, and he misses an opportunity there. Looking to be too perfect. Get it on the net. You've got a better chance to squeak one through the goaltender than if you miss it outside the net. Picked up along the wall by Taylor. The Flames gain control of the puck against the wall. Can't find his man. Receives the pass. Calgary's got the puck along the wall. And he makes the save. Oh, you're not going to get much better scoring chance than that one, but the goaltender makes an excellent stick save. Well past the midway mark of this period, Boston's ahead, 1-0. Setter's jammed up, and the winger grabs the puck. Santos plays it along the wall, dumps it in. The Flames have it against the wall. They fight for it along the boards, trying to get back on the attack now. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. Can't connect! Calgary's gained possession along the boards. Here comes the pushback. And the challenge is accepted. It's pretty clear, James, who had the upper hand.
Oh, I don't like when the guys start throwing them like that. Somebody looks like they're going to get hurt every time. But I don't know that the home guy did very well there. Well, with the chaos cleared, face-off now for both teams. Boston penalty and they take possession. Boston nice job tangling him up on the draw. Slides the puck over. And just out of arm's reach on the play. Handles it along the blue line. A chance. Too much congestion blocks the shot. And there's a much-needed whistle, Ray. Back in the day, you'd just take the puck and shoot it up into the crowd. That's a penalty now. The only stop you can get is from the goalie freezing it. Here in the back half of this period, the Bruins lead it 1-0. Nice start winning the draw here inside the offensive zone. Oh, you'll win respect for your teammates doing that. What a block. Kachuk's carrying it ahead. Manages to hang on. Denies that opportunity. He's sharp on that one. Nowhere to go for the puck. Grabs it in his own end. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. Moves it quickly over to Mayers. And he puts it wide. You have to get it on net here. You've got a great chance to score, and you don't even test the goalie. Denies him again. Yeah, he's pretty good positioning here, James. He makes the two stops back to back. Keeps hold of the puck. Off the glove. Pokes it away. Excellent hand-eye coordination. The Bruins scoop it up along the boards. Calgary's trying to make something happen in the offensive zone. Oh, and comes up with nothing on the play. You kick yourself in the tail after you miss a chance like this. Has to be on the net. Boston's playing it through center. And skilled use of the stick to poke the puck away. Taken by Applewhite. In the second period. Here's a short pass to Stahl. From the left side, they enter the offensive zone. That pass doesn't go. The Bruins grab possession to the puck. And that's all she wrote on period number two in this one. one nothing is where we sit, setting up what should be a dramatic third period. Are you looking to impress at your next group of eight? Then rent out one of our luxury boxes. With third period just around the corner, Ray and I will be ready to bring all the action in moments. Your time is now to reserve your seat in one of our extravagant luxury boxes. See our website for details. a skater short their player who was injured earlier will not be back tonight thanks very much for the update ray here we go put up or shut up for both teams here in this third period we are underway ray ferraro is between the benches at ice level ray we've got 40 minutes played so far how have you viewed things the flames are losing and it's really no surprise as hard as they've worked they haven't had their hands on the puck very much and as a result no offense and that's stopped by the goaltender using his head this time. Now, well, whatever you got to do, I guess. Man, those guys are lucky the masks are as good as they are now. Calgary's got a hold of it against the wall. Good heads-up play in the defensive zone. Puts it on net, and the traffic jam in front blocks the shot. Moves right to the middle. Quick pass to Travis. Wide of the net. Oh, man, he's frustrated with himself. He's got to get that on the net. Along the right wing, they enter the attacking area. Great chance in front, and they can't connect. Travis takes it along the wing. From the right side, he goes to the middle of the neutral zone. Puck grabbed by Esquivel. Drives to the sweet spot, and he denied that opportunity. Fleener's back at it. Looks like the rambunctious part of his game is over, and it's now time to play hockey again. Blades takes it across the line. Pokes it away in his own end. Calgary's got the puck in their own end. Tries to feed it over to Groot. Moves the puck along the half wall. The Bruins gain possession along the wall. 
Moves it to Fleener. Quick shot. Stopped by the goaltender. Oh, he put it just wide as it hits the outside of the post. Calgary's starting to generate some better chance. Scores! Good things come to those that way. Yeah, finally rewarded for all the work they did around the front of the net and in the offensive zone there. Finally able to punch through. The goalie's trying to read the shooter's stick. He doesn't read it right. He leaves the legs open and the puck beats him five hole. The Flames have made this a game once again here in the third. Well, it's set up for a race to the finish now. Tied here in the middle portion of the third period. Fleener's won it. And now it's grabbed by Heinen. Along the boards, they battle for the puck back and forth. Boston's got a hold of it along the wall. Makes a move in front. Stopped by the goaltender. Fleener's got the puck in his own zone. Slides it across to Bell. Strong defensive effort. Tyler's taking the puck now here inside his own territory. Across the line. Wrist one, and that's broken up. Yeah, puck doesn't get to the net. Good positioning by the defender. And he slides it quickly to Santos. From the right side, they gain the zone. Sends it over. Comes up with the stop. Calgary's got the puck along the boards. A little crashing and banging forces the turnover. Puck battle along the boards. Calgary's got control of it now from their own end. Looking dangerous as they move along the boards. Sends it in deep. Boston's got the puck along the wall. Calgary's got it from behind the net. The Flames gain possession of the puck here in the offensive end. We got a penalty coming up here. And the goaltender gets to the bench for the extra attacker. His reflexes on display tonight. Play comes to a stop, and let's see what the call is. Costi's off to the box, holding the call. He's going to see this on the big board once he sits down. He'll see this as a penalty. First chance of the night here on the man advantage. Coaches always talk about the importance of excellent special teams. You don't necessarily have to score, but you can gain some momentum. Past the midway mark of the frame, James and Ray with you tonight. It's all tied up. That's a smart read with the two centermen tied up. And the officials stop the play as that one goes into the bench. The centermen glide into position. The Flames take possession off the faceoff. A spirited battle along the boards for the puck. Nice poke check inside the attacking zone. Trying to get the puck out of harm's way. Off the glass and out of the zone. Consider that a win for the penalty killers for now. You bet it is. Now they can get a change, get some fresh people on the ice. Good defensive effort to poke it away. There's the whistle. Offside is the call. Boston's won the draw. More time off the clock as they grab the puck. Good clearing attempt to breathe. Tries to get this man advantage going from their own end now. Angles it over to Heinen. Into the attacking area from the left side. Scooped up along the wall by Travis. The Bruins have possession shorthanded. Puck moved back to center, forcing them to regroup. The Flames have it against the wall. That's moved up ahead. Oh, smart heads up play to poke that one away. Takes a shot, and that's broken up. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. Gets it out of his own end. Travis works the puck in his own zone. Still tied here as the power play fails to come up with a goal. Now the power play will wrap up, and they miss with a chance to score a really important power play goal. Quick feed to Taylor. And there's the save. Can't catch up to the pass. 
Calgary's got it against the boards. Hangs on to the puck. Boston's gained possession along the boards. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. Kamenev's got it in the offensive zone. And he's taken down the official's arm, signaling for a penalty. Here comes the sentence. The Bruins will lose a man tripping the call. She swipes out the feet, and that penalty's going to be called all the time. Calgary's power play unit puts their hard hats on as they go back to work. I like this. They got together right before the faceoff and discussed a couple of options. They haven't had a lot of opportunities tonight. The Flames get a hold of the puck along the boards. Great pass from the left wing. And that skips away on a nice defensive deflection. Maintains possession. Cuts to the paint. Oh, aggressive move as he pokes it away. Stick save from the goaltender. Smothered that in close chance. A big face off here inside the offensive end. The Flames win it. Knocks the puck loose. Quick feed down low. On the doorstep. A chance. He gets a piece of it with a stick. Outlaw's locked in. Every puck hits him and stays in front of him. On the odd chance there's a rebound, he tracks that well, too. Taken along the wall by Esquivel. Puck clears the zone. The Flames have it behind the cage. Moves it quickly over to Esquivel. Big play inside the defensive zone. And a stick in the lane ends that threat. Play whistled dead because of an offside. These are positional saves. This is a good scoring chance, and he makes the stop with his stick. In the final moments of this period, the next goal could be a big one as we are tied. Puck is dropped, and we are back underway. Ten more seconds. Taken by Fleener. Here's a short pass to Anderson. Stopped by the goaltender. The Flames go over on the power play, and with it, a blown opportunity to seize control of the game. Oh, I really like the penalty kill there. They were on the same page almost all over the ice that entire power play. The game stays tied because of their fine work. Quick pass to Santos. The Flames gain control of the puck against the wall. The Bruins will play it from the defensive zone. Scrum along the boards. Nice poke check. Puck scooped up by Fleener. Glides along the blue line. The Flames have it in the offensive end. Comes up with the stop. I think he got a blocker on that one. Couldn't find the intended target. Moves it to Applewhite. Denied by the goaltender. You put this kind of pressure on, eventually they can't chase you anymore. Now he's got room to carry the puck. Those are the saves that are gifts from the goaltender. That looked like an automatic goal. He's able to make the stop. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. The Bruins get a hold of the puck in their own end. Takes the pass. The Bruins move the puck in the defensive zone. Looks to pass it to Santos. And a great save. Still nothing solved as the third period comes to an end. We've got overtime looming. Looking for a way to show love for your team? Don't forget, the hack giveaway night is right around the corner. We'll take the a quick break, but don't go anywhere. Overtime is coming your way next. Are you hashtagging overtime challenge on social media? Because they're ready to get it underway. 
Puck is dropped and OT has begun. Quick feed to Travis. Moves it around along the half wall. Sends it out right in front. Huge stick saved by the goaltender. Pass right on the doorstep. Knocked away. Made the save on the play. Puck picked up by Ryan. The Bruins will play it in their own end. Up along the wing. Moved out in front. Game on a stick. And he regains control of the puck. Oh, somebody called 911 on that robbery with the glove. He had to be on top of his game to make that stop. That's a great scoring chance, and he turns it aside. This is a face-off. They'll definitely want to win here inside the offensive zone. The Bruins win the draw. For the win! Can't get it to go. Denied that one. Sharp reaction save. A critical draw here. Boston's won the draw. Musa quickly over to your boy Oven. Blocked in traffic. Esquivel's picking up steam. Here's a chance. From the point, they take control of it. What a stop as he puts out the fire. And the puck's kicked free. Battling for it along the boards. Grabbed along the board by Esquivel. The Bruins scoop it up along the boards. Here they come up along the wing. Calgary's got the puck in the defensive end. Here's a short pass to your boy Oven. Move to the middle, and they can't connect. Moves the puck. Off target. Quick pass to Kamenev, and that one's turned away. Boston's got a hold of it against the wall. Takes a shot, makes a save. Calgary's regained possession of the puck. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. How do you miss that, Ray? I don't know, but we all do. You're right in a scoring zone, and you don't even test the goalie. The Flames have it now, and tries to make a diagonal pass to Esquivel. Centering pass! Glove save, and he handles it with ease. He's not going to face many more high-danger chances than that, but he snares that attempt. This shot comes from a real dangerous area on the ice, but the goalie's in position, and he makes a nice stick save. The setters will glide into the dot. They take possession as he locks them up off the faceoff. Picked up along the boards by Groot. For the win! Misses a golden opportunity there. Hit the net. No chance to score if you don't get the puck on target. Now he takes it over the line. Here's a shot with the stop. The Flames get a hold of the puck in their own end. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Here they are on the attack with the steal. Glove save, and he made it look simple. The most fun save for the goaltender, the glove stop. I wanted another look at this one. I'm sure you guys were all impressed as I was. What a save by the goalie. A big draw looming here in the offensive zone. The Flames win the faceoff. Here's a shot denied by the blocker. A lot on the line here in this offensive zone faceoff. Calgary's won the draw and they'll go to work. And someone's going off here as the ref's hand goes high in the air. Let's get the official decision. The Bruins will serve two minutes in the box. You get caught when you don't move your feet. Now you've got to reach out to slow the player down. He's in the box. It's rightly so. As we're about to drop the puck, the power play unit back out onto the ice for another opportunity. There are times in the game, James, where I'm standing here and I can feel the excitement on the bench. You get a power play in overtime. Those guys work in the power play, they can't get on the ice fast enough. And they move the puck out of harm's way. Looking to break out here on the power play. 
Moves it to Anderson. Scores! They win it! Calgary's playmakers, the difference here as they come away with the overtime victory. Even see their coach's fist pump behind the bench. The overtime win always is a little sweeter. For Ray Ferraro, I'm James Sabalski. We'll see you next time we drop the puck.
Hi, everybody. Welcome to Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. Along with Ray Ferraro, I'm James Sabalski. Ray, fans have been fired up for this one for a while. What are you looking forward to most here watching this one? Well, goaltending is always important, and both teams have talked about the need for their goalie to be among their best players. But both of these teams lean on them heavily. And I would say the guy that plays the best is probably going to come out on top. Opening face-off just mo away the flames start with possession as we are now underway takes the feed Calgary's on the attack puck grab by Esquivel and puts it just wide the goalie was late reacting if that puck hits the net I think it's in Lots of time left in this period. Still looking for our first goal. Winnick's won the draw deep in the defensive zone. Quick feed to Stahl. The Flames have the puck along the line. Let's the wrister go, and that's blocked. Coughs up possession of the puck. Lee's got it through center. Long reach breaks up the momentum. Picked up along the wall by Esquivel. The Flyers ready to go on the attack. Slides the puck over to Travis. Break away! Moves it quickly over to Travis. Makes the save with the Trapper. Flashes the leather right in the slot on a difficult chance. Fleener's won the draw. And here's a shot, and he comes up with the save. The Flyers gain possession along the wall. Wrist shot from the slot, big save. Oh, you're not gonna get a better chance than that, but the goalkeeper does a great job. Philadelphia's grabbed a hold of the puck. Exploring options here inside the defensive zone. Great poke check on the reach. He's got a step. Denies him with a big time save. He thought he had him beat, but the goalie gets over to make a great stop. Scooped up along the wall by Bell. Streaking through center, they go on the attack. And now it's grabbed by Bell. Loose puck battle along the boards. Calgary's got a hold of it along the wall. The Flames take it across the line. Take it along the wall by Fleener. The Flames have it in the offensive zone. Working the puck deep inside their own end. The Flames have it against the wall. Grabbed along the board by Bell. Grabs the puck. Calgary's got it in their own zone. Through center along the wing. Shot! Oh, he might be shaking his head after that one. Pretty good shot. Nice delivery of the shot, but the goaltender beats him. Domi's got the puck along the wing. Here's an offensive chance. Wide! Just misses the net, but really the scoring chance is not dangerous if you can't get the puck at the goaltender. Quick feed down low. Takes the feed. Slides it back to the blue line. And that's broken up with a stick in front. Off target! Calgary's got the puck along the boards. They try to maintain possession inside the defensive zone. Stays with it. Puck knocked loose after that hit. Calgary's gained possession along the boards. And the puck's booted away. Picked up along the boards by Heinen. Inside the defensive zone, moving the puck. They've got the defense outnumbered. Calgary's got the puck along the wall. That opportunity is rejected. But he came out and challenged him. Good save. The Flames will play it against the boards. Picked up along the wall by Applewhite. Tees it up. Big time save on a big time shot. Feed 
hands the puck over to Schwartz. From the left side, he moves it up ahead. Great defensive effort with the stick. Scoops up the puck now. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. Takes the feed at center from the right wing. Here's a chance! It's in the back of the net! He scores! Actually, James, it's amazing to me how many times an odd man rush gets screwed up. They deliver this one perfectly, and they put one on the board. Calgary's on the board here. They've got the opening goal of the game here late in the opening frame. All you want after the first is to be even or ahead. They've done most of it. Now you have to finish the job. Scored by number 11, assisted by number 5. Wax it into the offensive zone. The Flyers get a hold of the puck along the boards. The Flames go to work on offense. Oh, and a little too much air on that one. He's trying to shoot that right next to the goalie's ears. Get it up top, but he shoots it too high. Philadelphia's got the puck against the boards. And that one's broken up. Great block there. Calgary's got it in their own zone. Throws it in. Scooped up along the wall by Don. Paco's got the puck now in his own end. Philadelphia's working the transition through the middle of the ice. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. Tees it up from the blue line. Oh, Ray, that opportunity right there. He's got to get this on the net. When it's on the net, there's a chance for a rebound. There's a chance for traffic to converge. Over the net, plays over. Here's a short pass to Adams. Move to the middle, right in front with the shot. He was locked in there. Right from the most dangerous area on the ice, the goalie flashes the glove. That's an arrogant stop. The Flames have been the better team so far in this first period. They've had multiple scoring opportunities and as a result have the lead. Puts it on net, that's off a stick. And pokes the puck loose inside the offensive end. And that'll do it, period number one is in the books. Well, a fun start at both ends of the rink. one nothing is a score through the first frame. Are you a super fan? Here's your chance to prove it. If you have the best decorated car... Two more home, periods still to come. We'll be right back with much more action here on EA Sports. Teams back on the ice after the first intermission. Ray Ferraro, James Sabalski, ready to bring you the call for period number two. Well, after an intriguing opening period, here we go. It's period number two. Puck is dropped, and we are underway. There's the whistle from the linesman calling it offside. The Flames continue to lead here in this second period, looking strong offensively. Puck is dropped and play resumes. Great pass from the left wing up the middle now. Nice dish from the left wing. Takes a shot, comes up with the stop. Cross covers it up and he's just gonna let the play breathe for a second here. He's been really good but hasn't had a lot to do in this period so you keep your team in the lead by controlling the game. Lots of time left in this period. Calgary's ahead, one nothing. Good job tangling up his opponent here. Travis plays it into the offensive zone. And down he goes as the puck goes free. Sends the pass over. Shot on net, gets in front of it. Wait, wait, no, it's in! It's in the net! It's in the net! Oh, he looked like he had stopped it, and when he couldn't quite find it, he turns around and bangs it into his own net. That's a tough one. The Flyers have even the score here in this second period. We thought this was going to be a really good hockey game. Now it's tied up here. 
as we get ourselves into the middle part of the frame. Puck picked up in the open ice. Manages to hang on. Quick pass to Harris. Here's a shot, and that goes off a player. A chance in front. He scores! What a goal! Two goals in 50 seconds. So quickly on the board. Wow, insane how quick that was. Bang, bang. Yeah, the defending team just couldn't put a stake in the ground. They couldn't stop them. He didn't waste any time. If he would have stopped that puck, the goalie would have had time to readjust. As it is, it's in the net. Philadelphia's gone up by one here in this second period. Pretty important goal to get to break the tie here as you get into the middle frame, and now you have a chance to control maybe the way the game's played. Grabs the puck at center. Calgary's looking to break out of their own end. Taken by Fleener. Moves it to Connor. With the steal. Along the wing, up the neutral zone. Quick feed to Fleener. Not able to connect. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Wild Wings got it in the defensive end. The Flames carry it along the wall. Nice defensive robbery on that. Paco's got it now deep inside his own end. Slides it to Tommy Hawk. The Flyers are on the attack. The Flames have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Takes it at center. The Flyers gain control of the puck against the wall. Looking for space inside the D zone. Moves the puck into the attacking area. Puts it towards the net. Nothing doing. Sets up from Gretzky's office. Keeps hold of the puck. Completely misses on the play. You don't even make the goalie work here. You've got to make him have to do something in the net. Inching closer to the midway mark of the period, the Flyers are clinging to a 2-1 lead. Gets a hold of the puck, and now it's grabbed by Wester. The Flames look to start the transition game. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. Scrum along the boards as they battle for the puck. And now he moves it to Wild Wing. Shot, no room for that one to get through. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. There's the whistle, and a penalty is coming up on this one. Well, the official's going to give him two minutes to think about that one. Yeah, you can argue for a few seconds, James, I guess, but you already know at this point you're going to sit down. And the man advantage unit comes out to go to work. They've been trying to push for the tying goal. Now they're going to get an opportunity on the power play. Stones him in front. Crispin's going to hang on here for the whistle and stop into play. It's a good thing he does because you haven't mentioned his name and I don't know how long the play's been at the other end of the ice forever. Calgary's been the busier team offensively with way more shots on goal, but they still trail in the second. The Flames will go to work here in the offensive zone. Gives them nothing in front. Dead center, excellent save. Well, what a quick reflex stop that is. Great scoring chance. More than half the frame has been played here. Philadelphia's got a slim lead. They lead it 2-1. Ryan's won the draw here in the offensive zone. Special teams coming up huge on that goal. They take advantage of having the extra man by moving the puck quickly. That's a beautiful goal. Puck possession so critical. Another faceoff coming up here. The Flyers win the faceoff. With possession Assistant along the wall. Shot right in front. Stopped by the goaltender.
Ryan's won it off the faceoff. Adams moves the puck. Sends a pass over. Travis has the one goal. It's in the back of the net. He scores! That's surprising so quickly. They've scored two goals in just about a minute 20. That sure changes things here on the ice. Yeah, the game has completely been turned upside down. It's really good work offensively as they grind away till that opening shows up. And that's the one-timer from the low slot. Calgary's offense has come to life here in the second at the perfect time. They needed something good to go for them. And even though they've got the lead, they've not played very well, but you're in the last half of the game. Now you're in front. Oh, he'd like to have that pass back. Crispin's on top of the puck, and that'll stop the play. Pretty conservative play here, James, as he covers it up to kill the play. The Flames have been the better team, leading in the shot department, and they lead it on the scoreboard. Slides in off the wing after the centerman tied him up. Harris moves it into the attacking end. Puts it up front, lets it go from the slot, and that one's blocked! The Flames scoop it up along the boards, and the puck's knocked loose. Taken along the wall by Esquivel. They go on the attack through center. A chance from the slot, denies it in front. More than half the period has gone by. Hope you're enjoying this one. The Flames have taken the lead here over the last few minutes. They'd love to build on it. Harris wins it in the offensive zone. That pass goes a little sideways. Sends it deep inside the offensive zone. Philadelphia's got a hold of it against the wall. From the defensive zone, they move the puck around. Puts it in deep. Fowler's on the attack in the offensive zone. Takes that pass back at the point. Puts it high. Yeah, it sounds great. Hit the net, though. You got a better chance to score. Slides the puck ahead into the neutral zone. Maintains possession. Made the stop on the play. Here in the late going of the frame, Calgary's hanging on to this 3-2 lead. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. The Flyers have it from their own end. They're picking up steam through the neutral zone. Here's a chance. Whoa. He scores! On the rebound, lights the lamp for the goal. Uh, goalie burps up this rebound here. It comes right back into the shooting area and the rebound is put away. got new life on the bench you can see as they even things up in the late stages of the second where i'm standing it's pretty easy to tell that they've just scored really a lot of excitement now the game is tied as we have just a few minutes left in this middle frame oh and the goalie catches a break there takes a hit he goes down to the ice and coughs up the puck great defensive stick work on the play picking up steam in the offensive zone slides it across it's in he scores that's surprising, so quickly they've scored two goals in just about a minute 20. Conversely, deflating for the other team. Man, that is a kick in the shins right there. They just couldn't stop the bleeding. Now the play opened up, and now it's an odd man rush, and we get a look at it on the replay. Enough time to pick the spot and put the play away. Philadelphia's got some breathing room here late in the second as they take a one-goal lead. I'd get my best players back on the ice, and while you've got your opponent backed up a little bit, try and get another one. Steps into the offensive end. 
Right up front, quick snap, misses the net. Not gonna be happy with this. He's got the opportunity to score. Doesn't register a shot on goal. Moves it quickly over to Groot. Moved up ahead here in the neutral zone. Nothing. Redirected shot, stayed by Big. Save right at the end. That'll do it for period number two. Boy, if you like offense, this is a game made for you. Every playoff game, our team store brings you our item of the game. Stay warm and stylish here at the rink with a scarf tonight priced at just $10. Make sure to stop off at any team store here at the arena. Pick up your specially priced item of the game. Our scarf tonight is just... Don't hard. go anywhere. Third period over. is coming up, and it's coming up next. Both teams seem fresh after that second intermission. We're ready to drop the puck on period number three. Third period action is underway, and let's see if the fireworks will continue here. Well, we've got two periods under our belts to this point so far. Ray, how do you see things? Philadelphia's got a lead in this game, which is probably a last shot win sort of thing. Man, it's been out of control for two periods. I love it. Here he is in front, and that's broken up. Stahl's taking it from his own end. Hangs onto the puck. Passes over to Esquivel. Moves the puck along the half wall. Battle along the boards. Grabbed along the boards by Travis. Here's a blast. Turns it away on the slap shot. Big save by the goaltender once again. After the first stop, he's in good position to make a second. The Flames have been the better team tonight, but they still trail on the scoreboard early in this third period. Winnick's won the faceoff. Paco's got it in the defensive zone. Handles the puck. They've got numbers. Oh, they telegraph the pass, and he picks it off. And a poke check knocks the puck away. Picked up along the boards by Stahl. And he regains control of the puck. In close! Stopped by the goaltender. The Flyers gain possession along the wall. Gaining momentum along the wing. And he uses his reach to disrupt the play. Turns it away. Now, by being in the right position, James, he gets so tight to the shooter, there's nowhere for the puck to go. Croft holds his position really well here. He's able to make the stop. That's a good scoring chance that he snuffs out. Still lots of time left in the period. The Flyers lead it 4-3. Well, that's one way to win the draw as he skates away with the puck after the two centers were tied up. The Flames take possession here in the open ice. Jabs the puck away. Philadelphia's got a hold of it along the wall. Pokes it away to stay on the attack. Scores! Well, the game back to level now. Anybody that's had a lead, the lead is gone, and now we're evened up again. I think the goaltender's got to do a better job. There's only one player in front of him. He's got to look around him, find the, where the puck is. He never picks it up until it's past him. Calgary's made this must-see viewing down the stretch here, all tied up in the third. They've had to work hard to get this game even. Play now we'll see what they can do as it's a new game. Assisted by number six. Excellent stick work on the play. Minutes, Across the line from center. Here's a short pass to Connor. And that one stopped. The setters will glide into the dot. Philadelphia's got it in the offensive zone. 
Here's the shot. Stopped by the goaltender. Cross reads the play well to be in excellent position to snuff out that scoring chance. The Flyers take possession off the faceoff. Centering pass! Oh, and he'll be shaking his head on that as they were so close. Puck dumped in. The Flyers have it against the wall. And uses the length of his stick to knock that puck away. Calgary's got it along the wall. The Flyers gain possession in their own end. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. Stays with it. Denied by the goaltender. Still a lot of time left in the period as we approach the midway mark. We got a tie game. Calgary's won the draw. Heinen's moving the puck through his own zone. Here's an odd man rush. Can't connect. Puck scooped up by Applewhite. Takes a wrist shot, and that's blocked. Domi's lugging the puck. Quick pass to King. Takes the feed from the left side. Good defensive stop with the poke check. Picked up along the wall by Kachuk. And now he passes up to Ryan. The Flyers take possession in the defensive end. Butcher stick handling in his own zone. Puck picked up by Domi. The Flyers move to the offensive zone. Here's a shot, and he comes up with it. Here in the back half of this period, the next goal could be a big one as we are tied. The Flyers win the faceoff, and he gets a paddle on that one. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. Travis takes the puck. Ryan's got it against the boards. Grabs it in his own end. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. Manages to hang on. Up along the wing. Handles Sports. the puck from the left side. Kind of lost control for a Shot second there, but regains cross. possession. Ryan's gaining momentum. Moves it to Esquivel. At center ice now. He grabs the puck. Here's a shot. Stopped by the goaltender. Scooped up along the wall by Ryan. Moves it around along the half wall. Let's it go. Just wide. Chrisman's going to hang on for a whistle here in the third. Well, there's not much time left here as you get into the final 20 minutes. The game's close. A mistake now would be critical. Those are the saves that are gifts from the goaltender. That looked like an automatic goal. He's able to make the stop. Here in the late goings of the period, we are all tied up in this one. Nice job tying up his opponent. Fowler's got the puck in his own zone. Brooks working it around in the corner. And a penalty is coming up as the play is whistled dead here. And Philly gets their first the power play of the game. The Pretty tough to argue when you've got your hand wrapped around the guy's arm. Penalty for holding. Philadelphia's got a great opportunity here on the power play. I always felt on the power play, the first one was really important for any team. If you stumble around on the first power play, guys start to press as you get more and more of them through the game. Back to the point it goes. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. From the slot, blocked in front, and makes the save. Trying to get it out of the road end. And it's cleared all the way down And that's a big defensive play with that clearing. Yeah, you got to focus on it, James. It seems like an easy play, but that puck has to I was actually up. talking this whole entire time, and my wife end. actually texted me on Snapchat. Kind of on. And said, uh, why aren't you talking? Now he's got room to carry the puck. And I said I was the whole time. So I've been talking these entire games, and doing play-by-play play and shit. To slow things down a little. And, um, a pretty good decision here with yeah. the play so I didn't even know. I was just talking about it. Cross has controlled his rebounds. He's made the saves. He's had to fight through traffic. I'd really like this game tonight. I told a you, Drew, last game that you were out the of the game zone. like 20 times and you weren't answering me. That's why I texted it. Off the draw and he ties up his opponent. 
Winnick's got control of the puck in the corner. Good heads up play in the defensive zone. Gets the puck in deep. Philadelphia's gained possession of the boards. Smooth sailing, that's funny. Good reach to the stick to knock the puck away. Coughs it up on the play. Lee so gets Bobby, but he still gets the puck, and they're letting him the skate it through. Slap shot net. saved by Cross. Lee gets the puck back. He skates right Strong through the middle. But Kachuk takes they'll it away and they'll clear it all the way down. Here while they're trying to kill off this penalty. And they get the puck out of harm's way. The Flyers scoop it up along the boards. Yo, Mark, get your ass out of here. Back to even strength. Huge effort by their penalty killing unit. That's a big swing and a miss right there for the power play. Critical moment of the game. And they're not able to cash in. The Flames have the puck in the corner. And, makes and a the save, save made by Rick Brown. Calgary's got the puck along the boards. That's the Heaney over to Cregan. He gets poke checked in front. Shot wide. In a tie game, you don't get many chances. That was a chance to break it right there. Then he gets poke checked. Use the stick to the puck away. away. And now he angles it across to Groot. Calgary takes the puck up. Along the wing. Here's a chance. Calgary's got the puck keeps the puck though. Gets it to Kodaki. Kodaki no loses it. Conrad play. takes it off the ice. Philadelphia's got it against the boards. To Cree. Cree got help. Has the highest, highest shots Over wide. Shot Sometimes the only place you have is up over the goalie's shoulder. Sometimes you airmail it. And tries to make a diagonal She's pass to Applewhite. Applesauce. Applesauce skates around Paco. Slap Here shot wide all the way down the ice. That'll be do it. It's feet. overtime again. There's the Second Horn straight period time. number three still deadlocked here. That means overtime is coming up. Looking for a way to show love for your team? Don't forget, Team Mac giveaway night is right around the corner. The first 3,000 fans in the arena will we'll take a quick break. OT Mac. next. Shots are 18 to 20 in favor of Calgary. Hits are 6 to 6. Time on attack is about even. Passing in favor of Philly, and the faceoffs are still in favor of Calgary. Power plays are 1 to 1 for Calgary, 0 for 1 for Philly. Let's get in the OT. OT should tell us who wins and who loses, and they're ready to get it underway. All right, listen to this place. The electricity so thick you could cut it with a knife. Sudden death over time. The puck is Here we go. Dropped. Paco Let's leads go. the charge over to Lee. Lee's going to play it against the half wall. Lee stops. He has all kinds of room. Shot saved me by line. Cross. What a stop. Puck battle along the boards. Trying to get Harris back has on it. the attack now. Keeps hold of the puck. Quick Pass feed it back to, to Paco. Paco, Paco back to, to Harris. Harris over to Valentine. Shot Valentine shot off the, the face lead. of Moves whoever 74 the is. Take it along the wall by Lee, Lee takes it around the net. Pass out in front. Get shot get saved by Cross again. A big hit by Valentine. Winkler gets out for the Harris. Harris shot saved by Cross again. Travis has wow. It in the defensive end. Philadelphia's gained possession. And that's blocked away. Moves it quickly over to Escobar. Escobar's taken up. It's three on two right now. Paco gets out of position. Shot high and wide. Valentine gets it. He skates around. Say Tommy up to Conrad. Over to Creek. Creek shot. Saved by Cross. Creek gets a rebound. Saved again. And a penalty coming up here as the officials all over that. And Philly are going on the power play. There's certain plays, as soon as they happen, the red flag goes up for the official. Stick goes across the player's Escola, waist. Hook He's on. looking for hooking. The game has become better since they've cracked Gunny. down on obstruction, Ray. The Flyers send their man advantage unit out once more. Everybody wants to be the hero in overtime, and now you've got a power play. A real chance to put this game Conrad. into your back pocket. Steals the puck. Oh, but now it's going to be cleared all the way down. Oh, that might be and another we'll penalty. And we'll get a face-off while one lucky fan gets Ooh. a souvenir. How is that not a penalty? That a doesn't make any sense. If that a fan gets a souvenir, end. that means it went in the crowd. Wow. Connors won the draw. Looking to oh, end what a save Connors by Cross. Off of West. Meister tries to skate through everybody. Alou! Alou shoots it wide. Heaney right clears it. Puck cleared from the defensive end. 
Philadelphia's got a hold of it against the wall. Well, it's a penalty in this game, too. I just saw the lane there, why. James. That's a good pass. Centering pass. Big save. Oh, he had to get up tight to the puck. In close. He takes away any room. The Flyers gain possession along the wall. No, it's not turned off. Inside their own end. From the right oh, wing, he moves it's poke checked. And then 26 cannot corral the puck. Grabs the puck and Kodaki's going to clear end. it all the way down the ice, most likely. Trying to clear. And that's a big clear at this stage of the game. Yeah, all Meister big gets now, hit. Comes back right in. Kodaki gets hit. Can't keep a hold of Alou. Calgary's hits Heaney, but Heaney's going to be able to clear it. And, and it goes all the way down the ice. To a safer spot on the ice. Philadelphia's got a hold of it along the wall. And he's out of the penalty box. Here in OT. Don't get Over to West. Better than that, and they blow it on the man advantage. What an opportunity! Missed the Meister, Meister James. shoots it wide. Conrad has it. They can't cash in. And we go back to Conrad strength. still has it. Here's a chance. The Meister right the to West. The West shot he saved by Frost. Lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. The Flames take it along the wing. Maintains possession, and he makes the save. From behind the net. And now he moves it quickly to stall. And a deflected and goal, and that's the game. Calgary wins it 5-4. to four. Flyers were stuck with their forwards on defense because of the power play. They never switched. Fair to say this one lived up to the hype tonight? The last day or two, this has been all the talk about what an evenly matched game this is going to be. While it couldn't have been any better than this. Webster with the second goal of his game. And that'll do it from and he deflected side, it in. For Ray Ferraro, my name is Your James third Sabalski. star of the game Get was Ren Lasande so with three assists. Almost getting the award, but not. Chris Lee, your second star with one goal, one assist. That's okay, Flyers are tanking for the defenseman. And your first star is Travis Webster with a three-point night with two goals and one assist. I didn't want to hit on instant replay, you idiot. Next up we have Vegas at Florida.
You leave my squeaky chair alone. I'm just a fat man, okay? Hi everybody, welcome to the Sunshine State here in Sunrise, along with Ray Ferraro. My name is James Sobolski. You know, from a hockey standpoint, this sometimes feels like an outpost, but they are quietly one of the most exciting teams around, aren't they? We have they a great matchup here between score. James they Stone. They're an exciting team to watch, but you're right, James, it, it is a long Mike way away Winscrew, from the, the who actually led up three goals for once in his life. We'll see what happens in this one. They have fished. to get this one underway. And this one is officially underway with the puck dropped. Here's a shot. Stick save for the goalie. And Bear off to no a big shot the right off the bat but Trigger with the save. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. We're still scoreless. Simmers won the face-off deep inside the offensive zone. Zero fear on this guy's part as he blocks it. The Golden Knights play it along the boards. And he's ridden off the puck. Scrum along the boards. Grabs the puck here in the neutral zone. Deflected away. Nice defensive use of the stick there. Hangs onto the puck. Directed over to Bear. Vegas moves ahead with the puck. Stays with it. The Panthers have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Working the puck deep inside their own end. There's the whistle stopping the play. And uh, Ford is going on the power go play the with a trick stick stick into from the Vegas. Guy's feet. Down you go. Two minutes off to the box. First chance of the night here on the man advantage. What a great opportunity to get the first strike on the board. Scoreless game, you go on the power play. You want to attack this. You can change the way the game looks in the next Oh, a big save by Twin Screw off that Trucker's shot. Trucker's got the puck along the wing. Fires it into the offensive zone. The Panthers will play it in their own end. Moves it over to Hendry. It's a two on one. Good defensive effort to put it away. Before he the shot. He gets passed around. Play. Blaine has Quick it. Turns it right over to Owens. Owens to Mills. Mills across Ready to Henry. Henry in front. Save. It's, it's, it's there. It's on the line. It yeah, is on the line. Save, James, right in the middle of the ice. Wow, the but it is called it by the ref. Up, he flares up the arm with the blocker. Makes a pretty good save here. Offense's own face off and he wins the draw. Way too much congestion blocks that. They fight for it along the boards. Music the puck swings the it around the games. Henry on front, saved by Twin Screw. Oh, you can see the shooter. He looked straight up to the sky. He thought that was past the goalie. But the tender made enough of a save to keep the puck out of the net. Lots of time left in this period. Still scoreless in this one. Trying to dump it out. And a nice job and it's by the killers on that one. Yeah, now they can get a change, get some fresh players on the ice. Here's a chance. Oh, a big a pass up to McSeal. He has help across. He does. Stoles Hits Beamer, but Twin Screw says no. Great use of the body to knock him off the puck. They clear the zone. The Panthers run out of time on the man advantage. Both and sides back to the even power strength. Play. Both will have to regroup after this. that. The power play doesn't cash Four in. Ball gets the opportunity lost for them. Battling for it along the boards. 
Beamer helps out Mills the before he gets it over Cornwall. Cornwall passes pass back to Britain. Britain passes to Danabola. Danabola to Cornwall. Cornwall loses the it. McSteel takes it away. McSteel skating up the ice. Boards. Nowhere to go with it, and he loses the puck. But Davis almost puts it in his own net, and Twinsville with a save. Pretty good work on the two-on-one. The defenseman gives the goalie the shooter, and he makes the save. More than half the period left to play. We've still got Ackerman zeros on the board. Versus the chuckle in the circle. They take possession as he locks him up it. off the faceoff. Davis Smart defensive play check. here in the open ice. Ackerman Feeds takes it, it takes it back, to back to Davis. Davis brings it in. The he whiffs the shot. The transition game. Taken by Akers. Ackerman and to Davis. To get it across Davis across to Voodoo. Voodoo shot save. Scoops up the puck in front of the net trying to clear the zone. Lewis and he slides it quickly to Lewis. Up to McChuckles. McChuckles turns the around Panthers with it. have it now. And he's skating up the ice now. And they send it right back to, to Lee. Vegas takes Lee possession. Lee skates right into Davis, and Davis takes it away. But Davis is too slow and gets overtaken by Henry. Florida's moving it into the offensive end. Nice poke check inside the attacking zone. Vegas has it in the defensive end. Voodoo has the puck now, the taking Golden it out. Knights work it through center. The brings Panthers it into the zone. CPU takes it away. And he regains control of the puck. CPU against Voodoo. Out. Voodoo still holding, and I knew it was going to penalty penalty. The Voodoo takes and a holding the holding penalty against the CPU. The play. Let's see what the officials are calling. Devil's been called. Florida back holding. on the power play. He's trying to hold them up here, slow them down just a little bit. But you can't do that. The Panthers once again send out their power play unit. When you don't get many power plays, you really have to make them count. One goal could be a big difference maker. Vegas takes possession off the draw. Zek takes it, but does not get the clear. The but it goes up to Ackles. He's going to go for the shorthanded opportunity. Oh, but he gets board played. But it takes the blame right in front. Ackerman saves. Battle along the boards. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. Moves it to Franco. Franco taking it up. He's not used to carrying the puck as a defenseman. He has help though. Oh, what a block by Zek. Zek clears the puck all the way down. The Panthers have it against the wall. Florida's moving it up Place the up ice. Phoenix. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. Quick feed to Phoenix Outlaw. trying to look for somebody. This Owens, Owens shot wide. He's trying to be too perfect. Ackerman to Zek. Zek will clear it all the way down. The Panthers have it behind the net. Exploring options here inside the defensive zone. All alone! Pays the Phoenix, he gets behind him. But he stops the shoot, and then he shoots wide. Good position to make the save. Owens, back of the Phoenix. Save again, Owens, save again, Twins. Really sharp, never loses sight of the puck to make the second save. Michaels had to jump right into this game. No easing in. He's been busy, but he's been perfect in the early going. More than half the period has expired. Still no score in this one. Snatches the puck with the two centermen locked up. Both sides are evened up as the power play has expired. How's well, that penalized player comes out of the penalty box? He can give a nod down to his penalty killing unit. They did their job. Outstanding work. And pokes the puck loose inside the offensive end. The Panthers will play it from the defensive zone. Through center along the wing. They've got the defense outnumbered. Vegas looks to move the puck from their own end. Loses possession after he takes a little hit. Nice pass. Offside the call, and we'll have a face-off just outside the blue line. In the final moments of this period, the game is still scoreless. The Golden Knights win the draw here in the neutral zone. Dishes it to Monopoly. Takes it to the Come net. On, he gets a shoot. Saved by Stone. I like the goalie's positioning here. He was aggressive enough to make a save on a dangerous chance. 
The centermen glide into position. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. His reflexes on display tonight. And that goes off a player in front. Takes control of the puck. The CPU. Panthers take over oh, on possession. It's poke check. So Here they come up along the wing. They've got numbers. He almost so lost so it slow. Here, but regains control of the puck. But he's Vegas big man. But he's just so slow. Receives the pass. Tries Mom. it to the crease. Shut. Oh, and a wow. good opportunity right there. You don't get many chances. You want to finish them off. So he'll be a little frustrated as he heads back up ice. Can't connect. The Panthers move it ahead. CPU taking it up. He's got it all day. He's got Looking help on the side. The but he doesn't zone. pass it. Puts now it he does sober shot. Saved by Twin Screw. Stone's able to make the save as we see here. This is a good scoring chance, but he's in good position. Oh, the Phoenix, Phoenix the shot stop. saved by Twin Screw again, and that'll There's do it for this period, first period. To an end. Still no score in this one. Are you looking for information on the stars of tomorrow today? Check out page 21 of the program or our website for profiles on farm team members on the first. Still lots of hockey still to come, so get ready here on EA Sports. Shots 10 to 4 in favor of Florida. The Florida just likes to shoot a lot. Florida has at least Period 30 shots. Number two seems ready to go. The on pace for again. My broadcast partner Ray Ferrar was also set. Let's do this. Second period underway. We're still in search of our first goal in this one. One period already in the books. Ray, how have you seen this thing? Michael's been locked in since this puck hit the ice the first time. He has been outstanding. Mills has the puck, passes it over to Bear. And now Bear tries to dangle Tyler. his way. He does to McSteel. McSteel takes it back to the other side of the ice. On. And he has room. He takes pinned it in. Along the boards. But then he gets pinned up against the, the boards because it's stops skating. And then and it's a, a holding call on Zek. Duff's getting called for two minutes here by the officials. He's trying to slow him up, trying to impede his progress a little bit, but he gets too much of a grab, and now he'll go to the box. Time for the power play unit to get back to work. The power play can move the puck quicker, but what they really need is to get a little more traffic around the front of the net, make it a crowded area. Here's a chance on the doorstep! Get it's the Henri, Henri shoots and saved by Phoenix. There, but regains possession. Phoenix gets the puck back, gets Felix poke check. Still has it. Has the Mills. Mills gets Big blocked. Eller slaps her. Slapper score. Eller with the slap shot. Our first slap shot. Goal. And Panthers take the one to nothing lead off the slap shot goal by Eller. Too bad Eller will probably never ever watch Get this. Get enough time to wind up for the slapper and he zips it past the goaltender on the it. stick side. The Panthers must finally be breathing a sigh of relief in the second. Well, after a while, you start to wonder if you're ever going to get a bounce. They get one, and now they've got the, the lead. The assists were the just notes. The, the two D-men link up for Florida's first goal. Couldn't connect, although not exactly an ideal pass to begin with. The Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Here's a short pass to Felix. Scrum ensues along the boards. Nice post check. Grabbed along the boards by Linden. The Panthers get a hold of the puck along the boards. Pokes it away to stay on the attack. Phoenix to Mills. Mills gets pinned up against the boards. And a poke check knocks the puck away. It's taken away by Flurry. The Golden Knights move it in. Flurry three on one. Franco's got the puck now in his own end. Vegas has it near the wall. 
the Panthers get a hold the puck, of the puck in their own end. Feeds it to Outlaw. Mills pass it up to Outlaw. And... Here's an odd man rush. Move to the middle. That one's the Lopez. Lopez gets it taken away, and then he Linden's trips the dude. Down. On I the think way. Lopez is the most penalized Panther on the ice right now. Oh, never Three mind the steal with all spikes. Let's it go. And there's the Shot save. save. Let's get the call here. The Panthers are going to be short going to the box. Call. Vegas gets their right, first power the play. Sometimes you just get caught. This time the player goes down and he's got to go to the box. And their first chance to use the man advantage. They deserve this power play. The last couple of shifts, they've been threatening for the tying goal. Finally, they earn a power play. penalty. Six minutes, Long reach they're going for the, the shorthanded goal, but it gets poke checked. Vegas is on the attack. Jostles the puck loose. Pokes it away here in the neutral zone. Nothing doing on that. Nice play, shorthanded as they get control of the puck and manages to clear the zone. The Golden Knights scoop it up along the boards. They're looking to make something happen through the neutral zone now. Centered out in front. Denies oh, in close. what a save by Stone. As a great older colleague of mine says, this is waffle boarded away. The Panthers have been the better team, leading in the shot department, and they lead it on the scoreboard. Center's jammed up, and the winger grabs the puck. Hammers one from the point, and that goes wide. Scrum along the boards as they battle for the puck. Excellent stick work on the play. Vegas has it behind the net. Vegas Rocks the side, on the play. Side shot, Picked up along the board by Fleury. Another Clay save by the moment there. Smothered that in close chance. Wow, did the ice get small for him. There's nowhere to go and he had to absorb this huge hit. Nearing the midway mark of the period. Florida's up one zip. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Can't catch up to the pass. Grabs the There is quick. Can he get around them? The oh, he is so quick. On the McChuckles loses it. An offensive chance. But Bear almost put in the loose puck. Into the corner now. Good Bear's use about to the body on the play. Lowe's out of the box and both sides are back to even strength. Well, there are times you look for your power play at the very Where least. He gain the right in the chunk of steel. They needed a goal. And then he loses now they still it. trail by one back to even strength. Inside the offensive zone. Alvin's taking it up, but he gets poke checked from behind. Jump dumps it in. Takes control of the puck. Vegas has possession of it now. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. Ooh, what a save Run by Stone. Trying to get back on the attack now. CPU Directs has it, it not passing, not Zimmer. passing, and finally passes up to Beamer. The Panthers are in transition. Beamer passes the Bear. Bear shot, the save by Twinsky. Stone's had to be sharp as this game is staying tight. He makes a good save there. Past the midway mark of the frame, James and Ray with you tonight. Florida's ahead, 1-0. Nice job tying up his opponent. And he denied that oh, opportunity. Oh, you almost with the goal. And now it's grabbed by Trucker. Cronwall's got it along the wing. Great poke check on the reach. How about Ackles? Over the save. Wow. The oh, and there it is. Wide open in front. Nobody covering him. And Ackles gets his first goal of the season. No way sometimes for the goalie to catch up to the pass. It's too quick. It's one timed into the net. Play set to resume with the face off ready to go. 
The Panthers win possession here in the open ice. Scored by number 19. Ellers got it in the offensive zone. And he takes a shot. Oh, what a block. He'll get it. was assisted by Yusuf and Cornwall. Here's a chance. Just wide of the net. Grabs the puck and looks to make something happen. Blades plays it now. Blades taking it up. Great He's running out of real estate and he dumps it dumps in. It into the ozone. Vegas gains a hold of the puck against the boards. They try to maintain possession inside the defensive zone. Slides the puck to Back and over to Davis. Here they are Davis on the gets attack. Check, but still brings it in cleanly. Blades takes Great it away from Davis, but Davis gets it back for Blades. Double down. Blades passes the CPU. CPU Fortis loses the puck. It along the wall. He gets around him. Along the half wall with the puck. He has help. Is he going to pass from it? Slot, he passes it back away, to Blades. Shot saved. Twin screw. Dangerous spot in the slot, and the goalie comes up big with the glove stop. Here in the late goings of the period, we got a tie game. Vegas has it in their own end. Davis the has Golden the puck. Knights move the puck in the defensive zone. And he gets board played. Two on one. On. He still has it. Maintains possession. Still has it. He gets board played away. again. Blaine's got it in the defensive the Blaine, zone. Now Blaine's getting board played and he passes it around the boards. Puck battle Back to Davis. Boards. Davis gets board played again. Back to Henri to Blaine. Blades bring it in. Shot blocked. Picked up along the wall by Eller. Eller. Right out front. And they can't it over, but he's being tied up. Line. Back to Eller. Eller shot. Saved by Twin Screw. Covers it up. Puck possession so critical. Eller was looking for a second goal of the game, but it didn't happen. Lowe's won the draw here in the offensive zone. Makes the save. Owen saved by Twin Screw. And less than Lopez. a minute to go here in the middle frame. For Phoenix. From in close. Shot by saved by Twin Screw. Michael's play has been outstanding tonight. From the time the puck hit the ice, he's been locked in. Great save percentage, and he's a reason they're close in this game. This shot comes from a real dangerous area on the ice, but the goalie's in position, and he makes a nice stick save. Great read by the winger to take possession with the two centermen tied up. Skidoo skates right into Vegas the boards. Vegas looks to break out in their own end. Skidoo skates into the other boards. And CPU loses the puck. But it's okay. It's the end Still of the second too period. close to call in this one as the second period comes to an end. With hot food and ice cold beverages, now it's your chance to join us at one of our many concession stands located throughout the stadium. <laughs> Big third period still to come. We'll get ready for it. Hope you'll join us. Shots are 18 to 10 in favor of Florida. They need 12 shots to get to 30. Let's see what happens. And we are just moments away from the start of the third period. The next goal will be a critical one as we are still tied getting underway here in the third. Florida's got the puck along the wall. Grabs it in his own end. And now he moves it to Tyler. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. Knocks the puck away in the open Tyler ice. Tyler brings it in. He has help, but he does not pass. Falco has it. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Gets a poke check. Breaks he up tries the pass to pass, but it's blocked. Doug has the puck. Getting board played. Looks like we got Doug's a penalty coming here, up here. And it's a penalty for holding on Florida. The Golden Knights move to the offensive zone. And he sprints to the bench to get the extra attacker out on the ice. There's the whistle, and here's the call. Tough to complain about this call holding. As soon as you not slip on a thirty position, shots with that penalty. Choices. Let him go, or try and slow him down. He reached out, grabbed him, and gets called. And they'll roll the power play unit right back out. You gotta have a short memory on a power play. You haven't scored yet tonight, but that can't matter on this one. Get the puck back to the point. Start moving it around and get people converging at the net. Stays with it. Centering pass! 
And he can't find his man. And they'll get it out of the defensive end. The Golden Knights gain possession in their own end. Hangs onto the puck. They go on the attack through center. With the stop. Here's a chance in front. Great reflexes, another save. Nice work in there after the first stop. He's got to find the puck to save the second. Stone's done nice work here on this scoring chance to turn it aside. Still early on in this frame, James and Ray with you. So glad you could join us. We are all tied up in this one. Akers wins it in the offensive zone. Flips it at the net, and that shot dies in traffic. Takes it to the front. Stopped by the goaltender. Big save by yeah, he got out tight to him, James. There's nowhere for that puck to go. The setters will glide into the dot. Vegas takes possession off the faceoff. Move to the middle. Routine save made by Stone. Soderbergh's won a big draw on their own end. They'll want to clear the zone here while they're trying to kill off this penalty. And the puck is cleared to a safer spot. The Golden Knights gain possession along the wall. They're picking up steam through the neutral zone. Moves it up through the middle from the right. Linden's offense has been non-existent tonight. There's not and many times you can wide. save. I His team's in it. a decent spot and he in the doesn't middle have right. any goals. Another I think it's a chance for a breather here as he hangs on and covers the puck up. Who, for the players or for you? Well, you know, I won't complain. This shot comes from a real dangerous area on the ice, but the goalie's in position, and he makes Eller a nice stick save. Eller scored for the Panthers, Tyler. Eller with a nice slap shot from the D point. Offense is on face off, and he wins the draw. Florida's got a chance to work the transition game now, shorthanded. And the puck clears the zone. Mills clears it all the way down. Vegas gains a hold of it, pins him against the boards as they battle for the loose puck. Florida's got it from behind the net. Quick pass to Lowe. And he uses his reach to disrupt Lopez the play. Gets hit. Slides the puck across to Linden. Puts it to the front of the net, and he misses. Flurry shot wide. He tries to put it on the front. No good. Davis. Spins. Gets some room. Poke check the button. Button to the side. Davis Slapper. Saved by Stone. Lose it to Outlaw. Hello, Owens dangles in to Lopez, back to Outlaw, just Outlaw shoots wide. From my angle, that looked like it was going yeah, in, he just misses that wide. Slides the puck he across to Flurry. He passes to Flurry, Flurry gets poke check, but it goes right to the side. Happen. Battle along the boards. The just side of the board played. They gain possession and here inside the neutral zone. Passes one, he gets around Doug Skates too, but he has nowhere to go with it, no help. Right he finally gets help, but he gets poke check. And nice defensive deflection. Into the offensive end now. And he regains control of the puck. Florida's got a hold of it against the hit. wall. From the defensive the zone, moving they back move up the, the puck, puck around. From along the walls, they're gaining momentum. He takes it in. Vegas tries to and break out. Loose puck battle along the boards. Centered out in front. Well, he gets in front. Twins through with the save. Yeah, Almost a dangerous spot. Goals. He makes a good save here. I wanted another look at this one. I'm sure you guys were all impressed as I was. What a save by the goalie. More than half the frame has been played here. You can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. Swoops in off the wing to grab the puck the after the, the center tied off. him up. Blaine's got it the defensive it. end. Trying to get away from him. It's not working. Again. He loses the puck, but Yusuf gets it. Davis Vegas is taking it up. He brings it into the zone. Takes a shot. Comes up he with shot. the stop. Saved by some. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. Sneaks away with the puck after he was tangled up on the draw. He was locked in there. CPU almost puts it in his own net.
I've loved his work tonight. From the beginning of the first period, he has been outstanding. And they take possession. Nice job tangling him up on the draw. Hendry's got the puck now here inside his own defensive zone. Here they come on the attack. He almost lost it for a second there, Six but regains control of the left puck. This one. Still one to one. The official's hand is in but the air. Panthers took a penalty. penalty. And it's Turn deflected. Wow, what a save There's by the Stone. And the official set to give the call. Caught him just as he was picking up speed, and he's going to pay for it with the trip. Oh, you're spinning with him. You're trying to get your stick into the puck lane, and you end up tripping him up. Back to the face-off circle. They'll send the man advantage unit out again. They've been skunked on the power play so far tonight. So you have a little chat on the bench. Guys, notice Shot some things wide. that the penalty killers do. And, and you try to adjust all the way one down. step ahead of them. Pucks the slip down in. the ice. Pinned up along the boards. Florida's got a hold going the for the ball. shorty. But he just can't do it. Up the neutral zone now. He used to do-do. To Manages to hang on. And he back in front. Opportunity in front he with said, the poke check. Quick feed control. to Cheek. Good defensive stop with the poke Voodoo check. Again. Oh, Save another big stone. stop. And it's clear all the way down. A minute left on the power play. Vegas takes possession along the wall. Quick pass across to Cheek. Pokes it away in his own and end. And he said gets poke check by Franco. Back the in the chuckles. And the chuckles are taking it up the ice. Over to Lopez. They're going for the shorty. Got a lost control for a second there. But regains. Well, by shot save. Dismissed that chance. Nice move by the goalie to get out close to the shooter. Here's the pass. Can't find four his ball, man. Ball, but the the Panthers will try to shave a few seconds off this, this penalty now. Pass. Puck is cleared out of the defensive zone. The Golden Knights have it That should do ball. it for the Vegas, Vegas power play. Back to, really to even strength. Vegas the momentum in this one, and they squander it by coming up empty-handed on the power play. Wow, that seems like a big miss, James. Critical moment in the game, and the power play laid flat for them. Right in the slot, misses over the net. Zach shot wide. That's a great chance. He's going to be disappointed in himself. Good heads up play in the defensive zone, and there's the whistle. Yet and another Vegas goes penalty the power set play. to be handed out here. Another holding call by the Panthers. The Panthers will serve two for holding. He's not going to like the call, but he's got a fifth full of sweat. You're going to have to pay for it. You can't take it home plays. with you. Or they have what a chance penalties. as the power play unit goes back to work. It's where you need a short memory. Your power play has been terrible for most of the night, but in a critical moment, you CPU have clears it. They, they, they have a the CPU end. on the penalty kill now because Eller was in that spot. But Solberg has it. Behind the net. Keeps hold of the puck. Vegas oh, a hold I wish they could do a wraparound or something. From the left side, they enter the attacking zone. The wrist a shot he off the post. No, oh, he reads the play really well to get out and aggressive Dug to make that Ackerman, save. Ackerman, the first play, on. shot wide. Goaltender's in good shape. There's not much room at Coming all. Coming the side, side to Britton. gets his puck stolen, and Mills is going. Center, they get into the attacking area. The Panthers will play it against the board. Because out front. Oh, but out. what a save. Devils steal. got it on the offensive end. The Panthers Takes will kill off a few no extra seconds puck. now. And, and the puck leaves all the, the zone. The ice. Nearing the final minute of regulation. One minute remaining. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. From the point, they take control of it. Puts it wide. Maybe trying to be a little too fine as he shoots it wide of the net. Stone's been their team's best player. He's been busy, he's been peppered in time, and he hasn't broken yet. Really solid performance. In the final moments of this period, the next goal could be a big one as we are tied. Snatches the puck with the two centermen locked up. Vegas has it in the offensive end. Florida's going to be able to kill a few seconds off now with the puck. Strong defensive effort. Tries to clear the puck. McSteel Not clears exactly it into the bench. The coach drew that one up. We'll get a face off. A big face-off here inside the offensive end. 
The Panthers get a hold of the puck in their own end. The Golden Knights scoop it up along the boards. Power play now over both teams back at even strength, and the power play fails to deliver at a crucial time. Not another good penalty kill for them, James. 20 seconds to go. The Blake has it. Oh, Blake's trying. When they've been shorthanded. Vegas has the puck. The Panthers gain control Owens. of it. And there's the save. Shot saved by Twinsbury. 12 seconds to go. A critical draw here. Lowe's won the draw. Gets in front of it. The Golden Knights grab possession. Another of the puck. save by Twinsbury. Vegas with possession in their own zone. There's a shot. Shot by Duncan, but why? Don't know if that would have been in time, time though. Expired, and we are off to And we're going to OT again. Moments away, we'll drop the puck for overtime. Shots are 23-22 to Vegas. Hits are 8-6 for Vegas. Time on attack is Vegas. Passing is Panthers. Faceoffs one is Vegas. Penalty minutes is Panthers. Let's get it going. Who'll be the hero? Will there be a zero? Overtime set to go. Overtime action is underway. Absolutely love it. Florida's got the puck along the boards. The Panthers take possession in the defensive end. Gaining momentum along the wing. Forces the turnover in the neutral Terrible zone. Terrible pass. They've got Versailles the has it. Number. He dodges the hit. Dumps it around. Franco scooped up the puck now here so inside Franco his own zone. Moves it quickly over to the ball at the side. Shot wide. McSteel runs into the wall. The Panthers will play it in their own He's skating it up. He has nowhere to go with it. He turns around. Gets poke check. And now he angles turns it back across around. to Zimmer. Hits Beamer. Beamer takes it in the zone. Gets hit. And McSteel trips the Doug. Doug second draw sort of on McSteel. Last oh, time there was a hole. McSteel second penalty of the game. The puck. I guess it's a little bit and it could cost him the game. Realize the guy's getting away. Let him go before you take the penalty. The official's making him pay for it. Another huge opportunity looming here on the man advantage. You don't see this very often. And so when you get this power play in overtime, you want to put it to bed. And they get some breathing room as the puck leaves the defensive end. Duff's Jack taking runs it from into his the own end. And then they missed the hit. Duff's got it across the line. Hangs onto the puck. Here's a chance. Oh, Cornwall so close, but Stone said no. And they managed to clear it. Vegas gets the puck near the boards. Slides it over with pace to Duff. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. And that one's broken up. And a successful clearing attempt. The Golden Knights have it behind the net. From his own end, he moves it up ahead. That's how you break the puck out. And he regains control of the puck. Oh, great read as he pokes it away. Drives to the sweet spot. Florida's got possession while undermanned. Good clearing attempt to breathe. The Golden Knights gain they control of the puck against the, the wall. McBride. Pass to Devil. The Golden Knights take it along the wall. Vegas could have won it with the man advantage, but the power play fails to capitalize. Sometimes the opportunity shows up at a really critical point. Here you are in overtime. Lopez has the puck. Passing it to McChuckles. McChuckles brings it in. Miss. Gets Kocek and gets the puck back. Moves into the slot. Gets Kocek again. Has the puck. Frogger slap shot saved by Twins. Vegas Twinsky. gets a hold of the puck against the boards. Here's the, the chance steal. to set up now. Oh, Jackhanded wide. wide. I thought he had that one, James. The Panthers Music. gonna work on offense. The steal steals. With the steal. Back to Bear. Bear in front. Oh, Backhander saved by Twins. right on top of this scoring chance. Nowhere for the puck to go. 
A lot on the line here in this offensive zone faceoff. The Golden Knights win the draw. Vegas has it in the defensive end. Battling for it along the boards. Cuts to the front. Oh, wide of the net. Most dangerous place on the ice, and he can't capitalize. Here's a shot. Oh, comes up with a stop. Michael's able to make the save on the slapper. Man, does he get that thing off and stick in a hurry. It's a good scoring chance. The centermen glide into position. The Golden Knights win the draw. Britain has the pocket stick left, but and he still shoots it. He passes again. to Davis. Picking Davis is bringing it up. In the offensive zone. He, he stops. He turns with it, gets around one. Britain shot. Blocked. Got it in their own zone. Manages to hang on. And they'll dump it in. Along the boards, they battle for the puck. And there's a power play opportunity coming up here. And another the Panthers hold. This time, And the Grizzly officials Day. stop the play. Let's see what the call is. Bears going to serve two for holding on this play. Well, he got his money's worth there. That is a holding penalty. That's because of his comment, tie him up. He just tied him up. And now you're in a sin bin. The Golden Knights once again send out their power play unit, and what a golden opportunity here. Sometimes you have to wait for your chances. Other times they come in a gift basket. Hello, power play in overtime. Their side, the flurry, flurry gets poked it. Flurry back to the side, their side shot. Saved by Stane. This is a face-off. They'll definitely want to win here inside the offensive zone. Vegas takes possession off the draw. Here's a shot. Denies him on the play. Play shot and another save. Puck move back to center, forcing them to regroup. Vegas takes possession along the wall. The Golden Knights will play it from the defensive zone. Taken by Eller. That one fired right into the bench. Stone's keeping this game tied. A critical moment in the game, and he makes that stop. A big draw looming here in the offensive zone. Nice job tying up his opponent. A shot! No, oh, denies him with the save! Another save by Stone. And Stone passes it out. It's poked the away from Mills to Lopez. Lopez is going for the goal. Never mind. He dumps it in. The Golden Knights gain possession along the wall. Here they come inside the neutral zone. And uses the length of his stick to knock that puck away. Trying to clear from the defensive zone. And that's a big clear on that play. Yeah, coaches are always telling us about details. There's one of them. Get the puck out late in a game. Gains the zone on the left wing. From the slot. Gets it out of his own again, end. And do it for the power had a chance player. to win it, but the power play comes up empty. Oh man, the power play misses here in overtime. The penalty killers can breathe a sigh of relief now. From the left side, it moves to the middle of the ice. Oh, pull, and they score! And Ackerman That's ends it off the rebound goal. The Golden Knights needed overtime, but they come away with the victory here. Just your head down and keep working. Now you get into the extra frame, you get your chance. Don't you worry, guys, we miss. still have one didn't. more game to go. We have Detroit at Boston. We'll see you next time we drop the puck. Third star of the game, Ackerman with the game-winning goal in overtime. Your second star of the game is Mike Twinscrew with a 960 save percentage. Your first star of the game is James Stone.
All right, here we go. Hi, everybody. Welcome to Boston, a city with almost 400 years of history. He's Ray Ferraro. I'm James Sabolski for EA Sports. Walking into the barn tonight, you just look up into the rafters. Look at the history here, We have here, James Ray. Bates it's a great place. versus I mean, no matter Coco where you are Raccoon. In these original six buildings, there is history. It hangs from the ceiling, whether it's in Stanley Cup or retired number banners. Yeah, you can just feel the buzz in this city all day long, and we are seconds away now. This All opening right, now face let's off. go. The Bruins take possession here on the opening draw, and we are underway. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Nash, and they fail to go tape to tape. Good hit to pump him off the puck. Boston's got it in their own zone. Gets control of the puck here in his own end. The Red Wings ready to go on the attack. The Bruins get a hold of the puck along the boards. With the stop. Still plenty of time left in this frame. Still no score in this one. Well, that's one way to win the draw as he skates away with the puck after the two centers were tied up. And now he tries to get it across to Kamenev. Along the boards, they battle for the puck back and forth. Here's a short pass to O'Brien. Came up with the save on that play. Really good positioning as he makes the stop from in tight. He had to be on top of his game to make that stop. That's a great scoring chance, and he turns it aside. Gets a hold of the puck. Oh, smart heads up play to poke that one away. And the referee caught that trip on the play. We've got a delayed penalty. And we have our first the penalty of the game. Detroit goes on the power play. Reaching for the puck, trying to be in position. You're just a little bit away, and then you get nabbed for tripping. Yeah, it's always tough to use the I got stuck excuse, right? It never works. Detroit's man advantage unit will take to the ice for the first time tonight. Obviously, goals have been hard to come by. Here's the first power play of the game. Nice poke check inside the attacking zone. Oh, he's trying to get it. O'Brien gets the poke check. Rose. Oh, what a steal. Rose gets it back. Another poke check. And it's cleared all the way down the ice. Detroit's got a hold of it against the wall. Boston's trying to make something happen in the offensive zone. Black's lugging the puck. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. Tyler's exploring options with the puck. On the doorstep, backhander answered the call there. Baines takes a dangerous scoring chance and turns it away with his stick save. We're still in the early stages of this period. Still scoreless in this one. The Red Wings win it in the defensive zone. Looks to make a play over to Black. Takes the puck as the clock ticks down on the penalty and kill. Black they all clear down. the zone. Detroit's got the puck along the wall. Slides it quickly to David. Right out in front. And they can't well, there's a talent. The talent can't get the shot Finds off. Nothing but air on out. shot. But another poke check. And they move the puck out of harm's way. The Red Wings have it against the wall. 
Detroit's got the puck in the defensive end. That will do and it the for the power play. It comes up empty handed. We keep things deadlocked with both teams back at even strength. Too passive, not aggressive enough. The puck gets Taking moved around the outside of the penalty Can kill. Really doesn't away. become a dangerous power play. Shot into and the shot legs gets of hall. Caught in traffic. Boston's gained possession along the boards. Detroit's got a hold of the puck. Maintains possession. Puck grabbed by Nash. Down the right side and into the zone. Keeps hold of the puck. Long reach breaks up the Kyle momentum. Twice, but he keeps it Taylor's the moving the puck through his own zone. CPU. Stays with it. Here's an opportunity. Here's a town -town shot the save. Grabs the puck here inside CPU. the offensive end. Down the CPU. Fails to find the Back open to the man. CPU. The Bruins scoop it up along the boards. Taken along the wall by Kamenev. He carries the puck up along the wing. The Bruins looking against the half wall. Wrist shot from the slot. The score! Boston takes a one nothing lead. Buffer, great speed. And a great shot by Gaunt. Assisted by Taylor and He's Kamenev. probably got about two seconds from the time that puck's delivered to find it. He can't see it, so he drops into the butterfly and hopes it hits him. Boston's got the game's first goal as they lead here. one nothing early in the first. Always awesome to be in front of the game. You push the pace. You make the other team uncomfortable when you're out front. Grabs the puck at center. And he's tripped up on the play. And then Detroit goes on the power play off a straight trip from the face off. the whistle. Let's see what the call is. Mayer's caught red-handed. Tripping is the call. He's fishing around trying to get to the puck. Unfortunately for him, he sweeps out his feet. Uh-huh. Another chance here on the man advantage. Well, they've gotten themselves to within one. Now they've got a power play opportunity to try and even the score. The best power plays always work. With the scores on the power play. And Detroit the gets a power play to to goal. To to and the game. Bailey Harper assisted by Phil O'Brien and Eric Newton. Now that's just critical. You control the puck off the face off and before the penalty killers can really get set, you've worked the puck for a shot. This time it's in the net. Nearing the midway mark of the period. We are all tied up in this one. Boston's got a hold of the puck off the draw. And now it's over to Kamenev. Big play inside the defensive zone. Kamenev in front of Taylor, but Taylor loses the puck. Taylor gets it back. Great defensive stick work on the play. And loses it, Harper's off on a breakaway. Harper, one-on-one. Big time stop. Save. the goalie comes out better on this chance. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. The Bruins carry it along the wall. Taylor gets around. Has help. Pass in the middle. Kamenev. What a save by He's Bruce. sharp on this one. Out on top of the crease. Aggressively to make the save. Faze does it again. A man advantage break against. And he has to stand tall with a good save there. More than half the period has gone by. Hope you're enjoying this one. We got a tie game. Steps in and takes the puck. Up along the wing. Dumps it in. And it's dumped in. Boston's got a hold of it along the wall. Boston has it, but he's boarded. Just he's going to come up with it. Detroit gets it. Striker. The Hall Hall slapper side. saved by Raccoon. Puck possession so critical. Another face off coming up here. Detroit's got it and they're on the attack. Denies him Newton. in front. Shot Great another track. save by Raccoon. He Lacoon. finds the puck. He gets the glove up. Makes the save on a dangerous chance. Detroit's won the draw. No Detroit goal wins the face off. Our Come center shot blocked. Center oh, pass it on front. What a save by Raccoon. There's the whistle as 
things will slow down here for a moment. Always a good play if you're not sure what's going on. Freeze the puck. Detroit's won the faceoff. Right to the middle. Takes a shot. Oh, couldn't see the shot. What an excellent opportunity, Ray. They worked their way into good takes shape. The puck. He's just not able takes the puck. to beat the goalie. It's hit all the way down. Regan stick handling in his own zone. Raven has it over to Cash. Through center along the wing. Nice stick work to knock the puck loose. Take away by Hall. Hall gets Prochek, though. Gutierrez scoops it up here inside the defensive zone. Stryker dumps it in. Clears it in. Runs into the boards. Course. Now he's getting tied up. Passes it back. 24 just Boston falls down on the ice. The, wing. the Red Wings get a hold of it. Across the line. Good reach of the stick to knock the puck CPU away. CPU shot. Rest through with the save. Sometimes you're in close. There's no room to put it anywhere. The goalie smothered it all. Here in the late goings of the period, it's all tied up. And with the two centers tangled up, the winger skates away with it. Sends it in deep. Detroit's got the puck along the boards. The Bruins have it in the offensive zone. The Red Wings have the puck now. Exploring options here inside the defensive zone. A chance! Shuts him down. The Red Wings gain control of the puck against the wall. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. And skilled use of the stick to put the puck away. And take it away. Raven takes the puck. Boston's got it along the wall. No pass for him. Grabs the, the puck middle. looks to, to make something happen. Play shot. Say CPU scores. scores puts it in the net with 17 seconds goal. left in the first. To take the lead. Boston takes the lead 2 to 1. A CPU with the rebound goal. Assisted by Blade and Maynard. I'm not sure how that got into the net. That thing's bouncing all over the place. Not even really a shot, but he'll take it. It's in the net now. Boston's got the one goal lead here in the opening frame. Better to be ahead than behind, and the coaches are telling them that they want more aggression. They want them to play more in the Boston offensive goal. zone. Well, that's going to be a penalty. They're going to have to call and that. And a penalty. And Detroit's going in the box. So they to keep get the extra attacker on the ice. Play blown dead. Get. Penalty coming up here. A minute and 55 okay. seconds. A little too the much stick in body. Hooking up on this seconds. one. Hence hooking on the goal. Yeah, I, I didn't think this was Detroit a difficult Detroit is collapsing right now. To make it all. Phil O'Brien with the The Bruins hook. get their man advantage unit out there for the first time tonight. This is the league's best power play. Now they get their first opportunity to try and increase their lead. And they're off to the races for the loose puck. That's the end of the first period and a pretty good one at that. Hey fans, a portion of tonight's proceeds will fund a children's playroom at City Hospital, providing a safe, fun environment for kids visiting long-term care patients. If you'd like to learn more or to donate, please visit our team website. And as both teams head to the respective rooms, two more periods still to come. We're two looking to forward to it here to on Boston EA Sports. As we go into our first intermission. Detroit leads the way in shots at 9-6. Boston leads in hits 4-2. Detroit also leads in time on attack. But Boston has the lead going into the second. Second period set to get underway. The Bruins win possession here as we open up the period. Bont and the takes power it. play is still intact. Blackwell gets around but loses the puck. the puck. And manages to clear the and it's zone. cleared all the way down. And as he stumbles, he coughs up the puck. Stopped by the goaltender. Sharp reaction save. Retrieves the puck, trying to kickstart this power play. And a nice puck check inside check. the neutral zone. Hall's got it into offensive Hall's territory. Hall's going for the shorty. But he gets taken away, and Green's going right to the ice. Right on the cut into the attacking zone. 
and it gets taken away by Brett. Brett clears it all the way down. Never mind. Gaunt cuts it off. Freddie has it. Gets Green. Blackwell. And then Gaunt the center is going to clear it all the way down. The Bruins have it behind the cage. The Bruins cannot get into the zone. No quarter given here as they battle for the loose puck along the boards. Line change real quick, and Green takes it into the zone. Green's Green got the puck. The pass Bruins blocked to, to Freddie. Freddie shot saved. Blackwell is well, boarded. Oh, the only thing that happened on that power play. Oh, that's going to be a penalty on this play here, James. There's the whistle. And penalty coming Boston up. is going on the power play. I saw the hole, did you? Yeah, so did 18,000 other people, so it's no surprise the ref got it as well. The Justice Blackwell, the guilty party. Their power play unit. If you can find a way to get a power play goal here, you can change the momentum of this game. They haven't got one yet tonight. And you find yourself starting to press when you don't score. Oh, if there's going to be a regret this one, that might be it. Yeah, that play is right there to be had. They just miss the pass, the scoring chance goes away. Oh, you can't miss that. Shot wide. And it's cleared all the way down. You don't get any if you don't hit the net. Get it on target, man. Quick pass over to Taylor. Up along the wall on the right side and into the attacking area. The Red Wings will kill off a few extra seconds now. Puck clear from the defensive end. Gustafson gets it. Moves it to Taylor. Scooting away from him to Taylor. Taylor gets poke check. Black gets checked. Takes it into the slot. Taylor. And base covers it. Face off in the offensive zone to the right the side. Lots of time left in this period. The Bruins are clinging to a 2-1 lead. Swoops in off the wing to grab the puck after the centerman tied him up. Freddie shot Passes wide. Freddie shoots Knocked it in. Never mind, he passes instead. Boston's got the puck Gaunt keeps the it in. He already has one goal. He's going for a second one. But it's deflected They'll over the They'll want to clear net. the zone here while they're trying to kill off this penalty. And, and the puck is center. moved to a safer spot on the ice. Plays it. And he runs into the boards. Break out. Slides it diagonally to Gish. Passes it across the goal. Takes the pass from the left wing. Green. Takes the puck at the point. Blackwell. Blackwell. Shot. Score. What a slice. Right under the goal. Oh, baby. So much three to one. Isabel Blackwell. Assisted by Green and Holtz. And they're on the board. Well, the goaltender thinks he's got the whole net covered. This beats him just inside the post. Boston's now up by two in the second. They worked hard to push this lead from one to two. I like the way that they've been playing. The Bruins win the draw here in the neutral zone. Scored on the power play. Your boy Oven's going to play it against the half wall. Hangs on to the puck. Back to Blackwell. Blackwell spinning, gets poke checked. Tries to do something with it, but can't. And Tanner takes it. And it's a trip. Detroit going on the power Time play. The to pass down his Detroit sentence. needs this goal here. The Bruins are going to serve two for tripping here. Fishing around for the puck, he gets his stick into the player's feet, and this becomes an easy call. And they'll roll the power play unit right back out. Once you get a power play goal early in a game, you start to feel pretty good about yourself. Now you get another opportunity. You feel like you're going to score for sure. Yes, the the it right off the bat. And Boston's he runs right into the boards and misses. Green gets it across. What a block by Blackwell. It really is. I mean, the play is sitting right there. There's a scoring chance Levis to be had. Comes and helps. They just don't execute Takes it. it all the way to Talon. Carries it across the line. Sends it over. Talon and passes. Oh, it on it. Takes a shot. Tries to the leathers. Leathers shot. Saved by Rocky. Outlaws goaltending at one end and the offensive output at the other has made for a good night. Works on Newton gets the puck. David. All the way to Leathers. Leathers gets hit into the boards. And, and it's they'll clear get all it out of the way defensive again. end. Tries to get this man advantage going from their own end now. Takes the Moving feed. all the way to Blackwell again. Out. Good play. 
Black Rover Sports Jack Battalion has it. Shot saved by Raccoon. The goalie's best friend comes off the up post. big again as it goes off the outside of the frame. I don't even know if that was a shot. It was just a off the post. I loved making that save in road hockey, the old blocker stop. Detroit's been the busier team offensively with way more shots on goal, but they still trail in the second. The Bruins take possession off the faceoff. Goal and the puck it. is cleared Pretty to a safer down. spot. The Red Wings have it against the wall. Feeds it over to O'Brien. What should just about do it for the, the power play? The Red Wings play. played along the boards. Power Both play is over. Even but they still are set like up. Hall comes down. Shoot. The just high. Looked, looked good from here, but it but was over. They didn't over give up anything. And the power play is now over. And a big hit. Coming down the left wing and into the zone. Rister. Oh, Ten minutes shot wide. Not going to get many better chances from that. Who's Dead that? center the right in the slot. Rose, good the punch Red Wings get a hold of the still puck along the boards. Up there, Brian. He skates around. It's him. He has help. Passing it. Harper back to Phil. What a goal. What a goal. Three to two. Rose and Phil O'Brien connecting. Or Harper, I should say. My bad. But Rose in is in net, there, too, with an assist. But 11% of the goals go right through the goalie's legs. The five holes, a toughest spot to cover. That is Harper and Phil's second point of the game. The Red Wings with a little more pep in their skates here as they get one back. The energy courses through the bench. The guys jump up as soon as they score. There's lots of time left and they only trail by one. Throws it in. Nice poke check. Your boy Ovens got it in the defensive zone. Moves the puck back inside his own end. Boston's gained possession along the boards. Here they come up along the wing. And he regains control of the puck. Detroit's looking to break out of their own end. Sends it quickly to Gish. Couldn't connect on that Gulch. pass. Gains control Gulch of the puck trying to keep it. the line. He's As the board play. to kick it away. He's trying to get help. Quick feed to Santos. Santos. Cash, cash Great Santos. Great Santos shot. Blocked. Black's got it in the defensive end. Blackwell settles things down and gets check. control of it once again. Pass it across the CPU. I had a steam now towards CPU the front. CPU brings it up. Takes control gets poke of the puck. Another CPU gets poke check. Got it now and deep inside saves, his own yeah. end. More than half the frame has been played here. Detroit's shown a new energy over these last few minutes. They got one back, but they still need one more in order to tie. Moves right to the middle. Oh, that's tremendous poise in the defensive end to break off the pass. Puck moved over to Nash. Can't keep a hold of it after that hit. Boston's got the puck along the wall. Pokes it away to stay on the attack. Grabs the puck in the defensive zone. Boston's gained possession. Pumps the puck away. Gutierrez setting up against the wall. And a poke check knocks the puck away. Battle along the boards. Boston's got a hold of it along the wall. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. Manages to hang on. Moves it quickly over to Mayers. Into the offensive zone. Slides it across. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. Here's a short pass to Erickson. They've got numbers. The Bruins take possession in the defensive end. Slides the pass over to Taylor. Moves the puck. Detroit's got it in the neutral zone. Puts it in deep. Battling for it along the boards. Move to the middle, and that one's broken oh, up. Oh, in front, Great but it is. With the stick. Tried to go through five the people. The Bruins take work. it along the wing. Moves it around along the half Six, wall. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Five. And that'll do it for your Still second anyone's period. Game.
especially the way these two teams have been producing offensively as the second period comes to an end. Listen up, fans. For tonight only, all team jerseys are 15% off regular price with the presentation of your ticket stub. Get yours before they're all gone. Third period is just around the corner, so don't even think about putting that controller down. Three to two heading into the third period. Shots are 13 to eight in favor of Detroit. Six to seven in hits in favor of Boston. Here we go. Time for the opening face-off here in period number three. James Savalski and Ray Ferraro set to call the action for you. While the centers are jammed up, nice job by the winger to steal the puck. Detroit's on the attack. A chance in front. Oh, and that goes wide. You kick yourself in the tail after you miss a chance like this. Has to be on the net. Maintains possession. Takes it to the front. Taylor is wide open. Kamenev's got Good control save of the puck like in this. the corner. Kamenev throws it around the boards. The Nobody's there. The Except for Tazzy. Along the side, Tazzy here they come through up. the neutral zone. Boston's got Gets the puck. Check. Kamenev going back the other way. Into the offensive end Avoids now. the Prochek from Black. The Passes it over to Black. Detroit's Levers. moving it up the ice. And, and he that's uses the Prochek when he does anyway. Keeps hold of the yeah, puck. Yeah, that's Prochek. But keeps it. The and then gets slammed into the boards. And then gets hit again. The Bruins played along the way. And the puck's kicked free. To Blackwell. Here's a chance right Blackwell in front. Blackwell in front. And he gets a paddle on what that one. What a save by Bruce. is in great position to make the stick save on that scoring chance. James Sabalski, Ray Ferraro with you here in the early going of this period. Boston's hanging on to this 3-2 lead. The Bruins will go to work here in the offensive zone. Stones him with the blocker. Another That's save by base. That's a lot of hard work for him to make this stop because he's got to find the puck first before he can get his body in front of it. Play set to resume with the face off ready to go. Harper's won a big draw on their own end. Can't keep a hold of it as he's jostled off the puck. Green the blade, blade the shot the blade. saved by base. Inching closer to the midway mark of the period. The Bruins have a little breathing room here, but not much as they lead it 3-2. Now a quick pass to your boy Gulch to Gaunt, to Freddy, to Gulch, Takes to Blade, the to Freddy. Freddy, stupid shot on that. Yeah, it's like it. But he pisses it out like a crazy Great man. As he pokes it away. And it almost it. cost him almost a goal. Lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. Takes the feed. Hangs on to the puck. Quick pass to Harper. Sick with it, but gets it to Harper. Harper to Blackwell. Blackwell shot there. saved by Raheem. Blackwell's got the puck, and he elects to hang on for a stoppage and play. Now we're in the third period, James. It's pretty safe to say he's been on top of his game tonight. Not much has given him a problem. That's a dangerous scoring chance, but the goaltender makes a great save as he's able to snuff it out. Takes possession off the draw. The Bruins move the puck in the defensive zone. The Red Wings gain possession along the wall. And now he moves it to O'Brien. Excellent stick work O'Brien on gets the play. Check. Cash has the puck. He's moving up. Nice zone entry he gets for the right too, side. but he gets around him. Takes the puck into the corner of the offensive end. He had somebody the in front, but he didn't pass the puck. Now and now Diamond has the, Working the puck, deep puck inside the around. Gets poke check. Grabs it in his own Justice. end. Justice. Back to Diamond. Puck scooped up by Hall. Hit up the hall. The Red Wings take it along the wall. Ball right gets on the in. Pass in the front. Newton Tyler's got the puck down here the inside back of the his net. own Rakeem defensive makes zone. An amazing save. Moves it on over to Blades. Up the Blade. The Bruins take the puck through the neutral zone. Blades taking it up the ice. Boston's got it along the wall. And he regains control of the puck. Blades gets more play, but no penalty. Gustafson to Cozy. Here's Cozy shot, chance. Blades. 
Backhander wide. Chance too, James, but that puck's got to get on the net. He just missed. Play continues here. Outlaw's not had many shots, but he makes an excellent save there to keep the game close. Here in the back half of this period, the Bruins are giving their fans something to cheer about as they lead it 3-2. Boston's won the draw. Can't connect! Along the wing, up the neutral zone. Great pass from off the right side. Taken by Gustafson. Scoops up the puck now. Gus is in place the Through place. the neutral zone up along the wing. He dumps Puck it in. Dumped in, allowing for the blue line to get some fresh legs out there. Arthur has it, gets board played. Trying to get back Newton on the attack now. Tries to help him out and gets does. Gets the puck over to Hall. Newton passes it up to Stryker. Along the right wing, they enter the attacking Stryker area. Stryker gets poke checked away. Pins them against the boards as they the battle for the loose back puck. And steals they the puck gain away. possession here inside the neutral zone. With the steal. has the puck, it's stick lifted. The Bruins and gain control the back. of the puck against the wall. And goes offside. Offside is the call that will have a face off Five just outside the offensive zone. Five minutes and 45 seconds zone. to go. The setters will glide into the dot. The Red Wings win possession here in the open ice. Sends the pass over. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. Nice speed from the left side up the middle. Moves it to black. Aaron pass and the play's broken up. And pokes the puck loose inside the offensive end. You'll need more than that front. to beat him. Outlaw's got Saved the puck by and he'll Rocky. hang on for the whistle. Well, in a close game, you've got to be in control of things. And he's had an excellent night so far. Detroit's offensive struggles have been the story tonight. Lots of chances, just not a lot of results. The Red Wings win the draw. Here's a shot, and that goes off the face of the goaltender. Outlaw's under fire, and he's going to hang on for the whistle. Sometimes you freeze it to give your teammates a breather. Sometimes you freeze it so you get yourself one. He's been really busy tonight, but he's been exceptionally sharp. This is a face-off. They'll definitely want to win here inside the offensive zone. The Red Wings take possession Detroit off the face-off. The face -off. Quick feed to Black. Back there, Sonny, Hammers to Pazzi. Pazzi shot. Pazzi and the Leafs up blocking that. Block. Boston's got the puck along the boards. Has it. And they can't shot connect. Outlaw's going to hang on for a whistle here in the third. Well, there's not much time left here as you get into the final 20 minutes. The game's close. A mistake now would be critical. Late goings of this period. Boston's got a 3-2 lead at this point. The Bruins win the draw. Boston's got it in their own zone. The Bruins are in transition. Skates to the crease. The Red Wings take it across the blue line and uses the length of his stick to knock that puck away. The Bruins have it now. Detroit's got possession at center. Inside of the last... Breakaway, 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 oh, save! Keep down one out, what a save! Outlaw's reflexes help him out. A dangerous chance he turns away. They pull the goal. Looking something happen in the offensive zone. Detroit's trailing, that's why they've got the extra attacker out on the ice and the goalie on the bench. Axel Raven going for his first goal, but he misses Detroit's wide, but the puck inside the was just a little bit too fast there. Sends a pass Harper over. Harper to Rose. Here's a shot. Oh, oh shot wide. Up, nothing on the play. Missing a good scoring chance when the right, game is close late hit. really hurts. There's one 20 the seconds there to do something. Rose stole the puck. Here he is on the backhand. Back Newton, Newton backhanded, but it's saved. Stryker has the puck. Takes the feed so in the middle of the neutral zone. Moves Five seconds. A slapper from Jim Black, but it doesn't work. Final the sounds and the bringing this over. one to a close. A big win, but kind of a funky way how we got here tonight. Yeah, that was not the smoothest of roads that they traveled, and they still found enough to pull out the W. Razor, they're getting the second ovation from the crowd. Did you guys have this when you were playing? No, we had none of this. Nobody saluted the fans back like this. There seemed to be 
no real connection to who was watching and who was playing. In the meantime and in between time, he's Ray, I'm James, good night. GG's everybody, that was all the games tonight. This went on forever. Whew. You're a third star of the game. Bailey Harper, one goal, one assist. Shots were in favor of Detroit, 18 to 13. But Raccoon said no. Your second star of the game was Isabella Blackwell. And your first star of the game was Phil O'Brien. One goal, one assist, two hits on that sick play that they had. All right, that's going to do it for me, guys. We'll be back tomorrow around 7, and Doug Glatt will be streaming. Hope you guys have a good night. I'm outie.